missed it. I fucking slammed that goddamn Scarlet and it worked. Look, I, I, well, isn't there like a scientific name for the art of hitting an electronic to make it work properly? It, it's it's legit, bro. Like, there's, that's, that's a legit way to get shit fixed. Like with those old um, TVs, you just slam the fuck out of the top and next thing you know it works like nothing happened. That's, that's a very bad message to send. You gotta beat the shit out of something to make it work for you or do what you want it to do. God damn. All right, where are we going? Uh, we go, oh, going back to the castle? Okay. Um, blow on the cartridge scientifically works. That's crazy, too. Well, then again, didn't they say that it's just like a placebo thing and it really doesn't and it damages it? I don't know. I, I, didn't, I never really knew who to believe with that shit. Why don't you... Just don't beat your kid. Just don't be your kids. <laughs> yes. I think that goes without saying, but yeah, just to make sure, you know, don't don't beat your children, all right? I don't know who in here has a little nigga in their house, but I mean, don't beat them. You beat your meat, but don't don't beat your kids. Well, that's kind of the same thing, technically. <laughs> I'm stupid. How about DK Tropical Freeze? I didn't really grow up with Donkey Kong, so I don't really have a connection with him like that. I mean, I guess I'll try the game out just to see. It'll be my first DK game ever. Um my boy will be like, God, from Street Fighter and that KO screen. But Dad, we're back, Dad. You were right. No, they're... okay, so you beat them already. Okay. Thanks, I don't need your empty compliments. Damn, Zeke! Talking to pops like that? Let me turn off one of these lights, bro. I feel like I'm overheating a little bit. Let me turn my AC back on, since I know you're not the culprit of the sound issues. Etika, what are your plans for Mother's Day? I'm just going to take Mommy out, um, have some fun with her and shit. And that's it. Um, I think my birthday's close to Mother's Day, actually. 2018 version, you have to lick the cartridge. Oh, ah, yeah, nice, nice. Splendid to you, too, Harold. Let me commend you for your effort. I couldn't have done it alone without Zeke. If that's so, then it appears I made the right decision. I trust you will continue. Of course, yeah, man. She's our friend. Good. Um, as it happens, there's more than it first seems. Oh, really? There's more to this shit? What a surprise. You got something else for us to do? Yes. You catch on quickly, Pandy. It's about the Latias. <laughs> you beat one pair, but there's more. In Araya. She put out a plea for help. Given your experience, I want you to help her. Araya already has a hands full. Okay, I mean. Alright, fuck it, man. If you feel like it applies, then sure. Why is Harold seem like she's whipped now, man? I prefer her when she was more savage, bro. Although I never really saw her savage, but I mean. Now, now, do not burden yourself. I'll be, you should be delighted to hear this. Okay, let's keep going. To Oriya. Yo, what's behind you? It's a fucking ghost, dude. It's about to fucking kill me. On camera, live. I used to be scared of shit happening on camera when no one is in the room. Um, This thing ain't playing any DK games. Play a little Donkey Kong Country, bro. The game's legendary. <laughs> yeah, there's a lot of legendary games from when we were kids. You don't get a chance to play them all, though. But yeah, I mean, it's, you know, platformers in general weren't really my speed too much when I was smaller. Um, They seemed like they were all over the place, so I was kind of, like, mad about them. Especially since I was already used to, like, Wario Land and shit. I mean, platformers back then, they were like a dime a dozen. And I mean, not to say that Donkey Kong's a dime a dozen, but you know what I mean? It was kind of like... Well, then again, they, they, they did more than... I guess they changed up the format later on, but I mean, still... It wasn't really my speed. But I, of course I respect it because I know that's something that a lot of people grew up with and they love that shit to the uh, end of the world. So, no disrespect intended. It was supposed to, um, I thought it was supposed to storm in the Northeast. Last night in the Midwest, it was a shit show. Fuck. Snow in fucking May? Let's that's some scary shit. Now just go. All right, we got to meet up with the queen, bro. Are we about to go to that um, underground spot? Are we going to uh, Fonz and Mima? Mima, whatever. We're going to Fonz. Tiny Kong has a nice ass. <laughs> Donkey Kong Tropical Freeze is one of the best 2D platformers of all time. It's not an easy game to beat. And if you haven't played on the Wii U, I strongly recommend giving it a shot. Well, with an argument like that, I can't deny it, man. I'll definitely... I, I guess I'll try it out. I've never, ever played Donkey Kong before, but I'll, I'll do it. I like the theme song. I love how Roger's bass um, lives and dies by this fucking series. I'll land ship. I don't even know what the fucking quest is here. Some dude who got like stranded. Follow your passion. Whose quest was that? Don't even know, but I think it was like one of the blades. What do you gotta say? What's up? Oh, the Wellsman cookie shit. Oh, you mean with um with uh the two sisters. Of course. Platformers are fucking huge back then. Yeah, that was the wave. Um 
But Donkey Kong Country, let's play one of the jungle or whatever. I remember the whole Donkey Kong series. I mean, okay, okay. Are we going to talk about the video where there was something behind you and you could hear whispers? No idea what you're talking about, my friend. Mm. No, am I going the right way? Okay, yeah, I just don't have the fucking map there, so I couldn't see. I, 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 like, the, I like the fucking DK rap, too. I got freeze uh, yesterday morning. I'm almost done with 100% Segment Kagura on the Switch. Damn, Grave. Nigga don't even speak the fucking language and he's almost damn 100% in the game. You just there for the fucking, you just there for the fucking pictures, bro. You could pull them shits up on that damn on Gelboru or something, man. You'll be good. We need info. Titans are packing awesome power. If there's clashes like that between Araya and Moradain, then their power will be spent and that'll be it for this country. I think of Moradain as the enemy, but if the Titan goes down, then a whole lot of people are going to die. That's something I don't want you to think about. Man, it's kind of fucked up. There we go. We found the queen. Let me save the game. Yo, Bubba Struck. Welcome to the sponsor group, man. Appreciate your presence. Thank you. Attica, what was the scariest experience in your life? That's, uh, there's a couple that I can think of. Um, let me see. Scariest experience. Scariest experience ever in my life. Uh, hmm. I'll think on it and I'll get back to you. Dark Eye is going to be scuffed as shit. I'm recording the stream while uploading highlights. This nigga's fucking multitasking, bro. You ever try beating your meat and eating food at the same time? <laughs> That's disgusting. Don't try. Um, didn't expect meeting you personally, your majesty. So I'm feeling like a very important nap on. We are honored that you would speak with us. And oh, my God. Motherfucking, uh, you got, got, I don't know why these names are, like, escaping me right now. But you got, uh, Morag fucking taking a knee. She has the animation to use in, like, interactions with people. Raise your head, flame bringer. It's I who should apologize for meeting you in this place. But we can't afford the luxury. So what's the deal? Well, here we go. Uh, we confirmed two of these Latias in Oraya. Their retreats? Wait, indeed, our army has a handful of drivers. We ain't been able to fight it. Uh, we got mercs on top of that shit, too. But they failed. We just don't have the means to deal with it. Um, we trusted you to bring the Aegis and any other blades to help. Gotcha. Well, it's time to bust up some Latias. It'd be most appreciated, man. They're on the side of Gullet Pass. Let's go. Harold, you ready for it? Of course. We're about to take these niggas to fucking town. Let's go. Loop Bomber. Is that Luke? Is it Loop Bomber? Mr. Bomber is in here? Uh, Etika, would you play Fortnite on the Switch? No, I, I have zero interest in Fortnite. It's just not my thing. I mean, I kind of like watching it a little bit, but I mean, nah, uh, I'm not really a Fortnite head. Let me see. Is there any, so where is this place? Let me make sure it's not in this spot. No, of course it wouldn't be there. But um, all right, to the head. When will you tell us the shirt story? I will not tell that until maybe uh, a few more years. Uh, I, I'm just waiting. I, I think I explained it before. Now just go. If it comes out on the Switch, you got to give it a chance. I, I, I really don't. I really can't. I, I, I have zero interest in Fortnite, man. I'm not gonna play it at all. But I mean, hey. Maybe one day, if I actually do get interest, I will. But right now, I can tell you, it is absolute zero. Okay. Is this gonna is this gonna conclude with something crazy happening? At this point, it just seems like Harold is doing these motherfuckers' dirty work for him. I prefer Overwatch. Yeah, Overwatch stuck with me. I mean, third-person shooters. Well, it's not. I play Splatoon. I like Splatoon. I play it on like um. Every now and then, I kind of lose interest in Splatoon, and I pick it up later on. You know, just moods, shifting moods. We all have that. That guy just arrived from Hidden Sentos. What's going on, man? Thank you. We're not really doing much interesting. Today's stream earlier, we didn't really do much. Oh, level five is done already. Damn, theory. That's it for you, baby girl. Or is it? Um, hey, man, in the stream from earlier, I wasn't able to find out how to open the sponsor chat. Could you explain how to, please? There should be two links in the description. You click those, and you're able to, like, have the chat in a browser window. It'll just fill up the whole window. You can try to minimize that to put it on your um, screen or on your... If you have, like, a multitasking phone, that might be better. But if you're on your desktop, that's probably the optimal way to do so. These motherfuckers got this shit figured out. And you don't have to do it for right now. Um, let me see, the etiquette answer when we're going to hear the shirt story. Yeah, I mean, like two more years or something. I didn't really speculate when I first talked about it that it would, um, it, that it would kind of, 
it would, it would be that sensitive of a topic to bring up to like discuss but it, it actually is it involves some crazy shit man eventually it'll happen man and when it, you trust me man it's been like five fucking years since i started this channel and you know you blink and that time passed we'll blink and it'll be 10 years nigga and it'll be 2000 and fucking 30 or something and i'll be like hey guys on plex storm showing my dick for coin <laughs> how do you get girls to eat your ass etika you gotta ask him nicely, man. You gotta make him feel like you really need him to do this in order for you to truly be happy and love him. And then, bam. Next thing you know, you got her fucking mouth all over the rim, nigga. And that's how you do it. I've never done it, but I mean, hey. Now you have the fucking technique. That's the way to get him to do anything. You know how many girls used to fucking say in high school, Oh, I'll never suck dick. And guess what? <laughs> I'm kidding. Or actually, I'm not. Etika will be 40 in 2030. Old man. Indeed. Nigga, I'm an old man right now. I mean, granted, I don't look it, but I mean, hey, I'm old, I'm, I'm, I'm old man, old man. Um, you know what's creepy? What if 560 people were physically watching Etika in the same room playing Xenoblade? That's kind of what it is, bro. It, it's disturbing when you think about it like that, right? It's just a bunch of random motherfuckers just sitting there, and they're just like, <laughs> Etika, <laughs> like, live. You know what made me laugh? Someone bought a RTX, Rooster Teeth, some little convention thing, and at Rooster Teeth, they have that. They have, like, gaming or, like, uh or um, off topic where they just do their regular thing in a live setting and it's like everyone's watching with an audience there it's so weird and hilarious at the same time it adds a dynamic that normally isn't there i mean it's like the interaction and the crowd cheering and shit they just talk random shit like they usually do i would love to try that one day it'll be so weird people will come Let's in oh what's go. he doing oh he's playing we a game and it's like <laughs> rtx was disappointing in 2017 lyra what's your opinion why is why do you have that opinion Etika, why aren't you using the bleach Joy-Cons? Oh, oh, you're right, my friend. Yo, listen, man. Every now and then, we have somebody who comes in here with a damn good idea. Nos Games, thank you for the heads up, bro. You know what? I will pull out... I'll pull out the Aryan Joy-Con right now, nigga. How am I not going to pull out my fucking... Uh, my Master Race Joy-Con? <laughs> I'm playing with fire. You know that, right? Uh, let me keep making these jokes now until YouTube goes completely PC on me. You know what I'm saying? Not to complain, we find a new platform, boys. Listen, y'all don't mind moving with me somewhere else if we need to, right? Listen, we'll take our services where they're appreciated. Listen, I'm already sharing my money with these motherfucking YouTube heads as it is, bro. And they want to cut down fucking creators and shit. Nah, I mean, it's whatever. I'm never gonna censor my shit though. I'm, I'm always gonna, I'm always gonna do what I want to do with this shit, man. Thank you. The Etikum, them Joy Cons be as white as Molly. Fuck, nigga. This drug dealing ass. How <laughs> you know? I haven't even. I've only taken. I've taken a. Have I taken? No, I've taken ecstasy. I've never taken a Molly, nigga. We conquered the enemy. There's no more fear. Thank you. Where are they coming from, though? First Tantal in here. Foreign species here, man. I heard that shit fucks up. Um, that fucks. That fucks up like certain uh, ecosystems and all that. Let's see. Uh, a message from Temperantia arrived. Temperantia? They got these things too. Aren't they normally there? They are spawning at an alarming rate called on Zatara Spring. Alright, so we gotta head over there. They're born in Temperantia and they migrate to the other Titans by air. Really? So we gotta fucking we're gonna we have to exterminate the Latias, man. I hate those dirty damn Latias. I know it's Laia La 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 or something? I don't know. I heard Xenoblade X has an absolute yo, I heard X has an absolutely disgusting taste. But well, you're not doing it for the taste, nigga. You're just doing it for the fucking turn up. Yo, I I ain't really focus on I I think I washed it down with some soda. That was a long time ago, though. I only tried it once, and it was like years ago. It's just out of curiosity, you know. I I, I figure my 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 perspective on it is try everything once, except for like the really really dangerous stuff, the stuff that like is meant to fuck you up. I will never try heroin, not once. I mean that 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 just that drug is made to destroy people, man. Like, no way. I won't try anything that's addictive like that either. At least like it has addicting substances in it. Like you can get addicted to anything. You can get addicted to masturbation. You can get addicted to eating food. Um, but if it has like substances in it which promote chemical addiction, no, thank you, bro. I mean, come on now. Sorry, Harold. Our job ain't over yet. I'm just fine. My Harold don't give a fuck, man. Harold's trying to fucking kill someone. Wait, what's going on? Uh oh, I think something's about to happen. Bubba struck with fifty dollars in the damn stream. I don't know why you're donating, bro. You're here. You're in. You're a sponsor. It makes no sense. It's like you pay money to pay money. Um, what's up, Etika, man? I just started going to university, and I got some of my scholarship payment, bro. You got that damn bookworm ass money. I see you out here, man. Congratulations. The dollar bills that you gave me, bro. That I, I feel like I'm already gaining knowledge from it. 
million. That's, that's pretty damn big right there. Scholarship? I'm happy for you. Was it a full? Um, it's time for me to start supporting my boy. Oh, you know what? Listen, man. There's a lot of other, there's a lot of other things out there that need your support too. You know, like don't just think of me. Thinking about think about other causes out there. But thank you. I appreciate that. You know, entertainment is big. I support a lot of entertainers I love too. But I also support charity every now and then. You know, just to help the world. Pay it forward a little bit. You know what I'm saying? Thank you, man. Um, without your content, I wouldn't have gotten done well enough to get the scholarship. Um, wait, if without your content, I wouldn't have done well enough to get the scholarship. Any. Good shit, bud. <laughs> Listen, maybe you need to go back and reconfirm that scholarship. That grammar's fucking off. <laughs> How do you get a scholarship to go to school and you can't type out a sentence right? I'm kidding. I'm being a dickhead, man. All fun and games at the end of the day. Thank you very much, man. Give me a fucking virtual hug. Bring that ass here, nigga. Thank you so much. Uh, <laughs> it seems like something's about to pop off in the game. So let's get back to the focus. Um, bro, it's all the same. Molly, MDMA, and ecstasy. Yeah, I heard, right? Um, personally, I don't want you to go to E3. So we get to chill with you on stream while watching. Unless I get a really good laptop at that time and then I can maybe stream it. But I mean, a laptop to be able to stream the way I normally do and stuff, I think that would be a lot of money. So I mean, I'm trying to conserve, trying to save up as much money as I can because I'm going to have to big, give a big deposit if I want to get a house now. Um, because, you know, all my credit shit. Well, not the credit shit, no, of, of this rent, rent blacklist shit. Turtle Amigo, thank you. I had to bless me by saying my name twice. I feel special. All well, three times a charm, nigga. No schemes. Are you going to touch yourself at night now? Um, yes, donating 2500 to Trump. Ah, shit, of course. What's this strange feeling? Harold, what's going on? Don't tell me my power is... Yo, Harold, we're going, bro. Oh, yeah, I'm coming. Is there any porn of Harold out there? Harold Xenoblade. Oh, let's see here. I'm very curious about this. Harold Xenoblade, um, Rule 34? My face when I'm in a game filled with hot anime chick, and then I see Harold. Let's see here. Is there any porn of Harold? And I see Harold's silhouette versus when I finally get Harold. It's like, huh? Yo, I know. That's kind of some real shit, man. I was fucking shocked when I saw, like, how crazy she looks. I mean, it's cool, though. Xenoblade Rule 34. Uh-oh, here we go. Okay, it's getting serious now. Give me a second. Let me block this with my fucking screen. This is not Plex Storm, or well, you know, let, let, let's see here. I'm just, I just want to. Um, this is out of curiosity. Um, best friends Olivia and Neo. Okay. Whoa, that's a good. That's a save. That's a save right there. I'm doing that in the bank. I mean, I'm not gonna. Whoa. Oh, okay. I, I can, I can show this, but this, this. <laughs> this is some next level. <laughs> All right, bro. You know what? That's a save. That's a save. <laughs> I mean, nigga, what, can you? I'm a human being. I am an African American. Well, no, African American doesn't matter. I'm a, I'm a, I'm a human being who's male. That's a safe. Let me see. What, what else? Oh, whoa! I gotta make sure that didn't show. Yeah. Okay. 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 I don't see any Harold though. Titty fucking Nia's ready for the cut. Oh, oh, what? That's a safe. Oh. <laughs> We gonna shop in this blade, <laughs> yo, yo. <laughs> <Woo>. <laughs> damn. I, I haven't seen this on any websites, man. It's not like Eddie, hey, you nasty ass. Hey, listen, <laughs> I got the fucking. That's the <laughs> nigga said. That's a save. You got me with the fucking woke eyes. A ding, save. <laughs> uh, show us, good father. I cannot show you for these fruits will completely strip me of my rank on this on this uh, platform. You know what I'm saying? Hey, nice joke, Etika. I'm a human. You know that your kind doesn't count as human, my boy. Oh, my kind? You mean dudes with flat tops? We're humans, too. I don't know what else you're implying by that. Let's see. Um, I don't see any hell. Titty fucking Let us face the day I already have that image. I have that image. And that one. That one I don't have, but it's not all that good. If they're blushing at you, yep, I have that image, too. Nia's thick gourmati ass. <laughs> I love the fucking titles of this stuff. I mean, damn, this one doesn't really show any naughty bits, but it shows like a lot of ass. That, that, you know what? That's a save. Why am I looking this up now, bro? I could have done this anytime, and I'm doing this now. Wow. Myth were giving. Okay, you know what? I'm gonna be. <laughs> I'm gonna be here all day. Especially since I'm not in the greatest of moods, bro. I'm fucking. I, I gotta fucking. I'm trying to lift my mood and shit. You know what? Okay, we're done. We're done here. Wow. 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 Gourmet. 
the, this fucking Reddit is crazy. They got, I got porn I've never even seen before. These characters. What the fuck is this? I'm looking for Harold though. No, I'm looking for Harold, bro. That's a safe one. Okay, let me let me see. We're, we're go. You know, I'm gonna pin this. I'm. <laughs> I'm gonna pin this. Left in my mood. Stop looking at the pussy's pussy. <laughs> <Listen>. <laughs> we're all human beings. At the end of the day. We have, this is natural. This is natural for us. We're supposed to do this. I, I, as a red-blooded man, that's that's natural. But I'm looking for Harold specifically, just out of curiosity. Harold, Rule 34, Xenoblade. Uh, let me see. I'm going to just open up Google Images and see if I scroll, if I see any. No, I don't think anyone's made any porn of um, our girl, Harold. Although, I don't, I guess they wouldn't really. I mean, I don't know. They want to? Well, nope, that doesn't exist. That's one thing that doesn't exist, man. If you guys ever find any, let me know. So at least it can kind of like, you know, just out of, you know, it'll be informative. Like, oh, there is point of Harold. At least share the link. Okay. <laughs> okay. And, no, it's easy. Just go to um, Reddit and search up this. There's a lot of great shit in here, man. Like, this is top that top tier content, man. They got some, you know, the guys on here, they got a good eye. Let's, let's, let's search this on fucking Reddit, okay? Attica, you ever go in a VidCon? Eh, nah, not really. I mean, I think that's made for, like, the huge creators. I'm not really there. And But I might go for fun just to, like, meet up with some other people there that um, also do YouTube and stuff. It seems like VidCons may be made more for the faces of YouTube, not the dark side of YouTube. You know what I'm saying? But that's just an opinion that I have now. Maybe it'll change later on, you know? Anything can change later, dog. Uh, human opinion is meant to be fluid. Where are we going? We're going to um, Temperantia, right? Let's go to the Central Plain. I'm not sure exactly where, but I'm hoping it's in the middle. I thought Harold was a guy. What the fuck? Nah, man, that's a woman. I knew that was a woman the first time I laid eyes on her. <laughs> we came a pretty long way, hey? We should depart imminently. Man, despite all that rough exterior and all that crazy backstory and dead bodies on her tails and overwhelming power that can completely destroy an entire this civilization, deep this inside of that is. body beats the heart of a woman, man. And I, I, you, you can you can sense it. You know what I'm saying? Anyways, <laughs> I love women. Um, I'm already beating my dick. Yo, I'm telling it's good shit. That, that ready got it going on, bro. I don't even fuck with ready like that. Edek, I thought you were family friendly, bro. You must have. You, did you look up EWN or CND? Yeah, Harold's a girl, man. Just like how that pizza girl was a girl. Um, how many tubs do you need to use for that three terabyte folder of hentai? My my hentai folder. It's not. How big is my hentai folder? Let me take a look at this shit. Um, I'll show you guys right now. All right, man. So I'm kind of baby level right now. I, I don't really have much. Like you can see right here. My hentai folder is only 1.43 gigabytes, man. So, I mean, I'm kind of lacking. I know niggas out there, um, niggas like Link Master, who have a fucking, like, 10 terabyte con um, collection. And they got, like, they got fucking external hard drives with the shit loaded up with just a bunch of fucking pornography. My shit is lagging. My shit's a little weaker than that. You know, I don't really look for porn frequently, man. I don't really always go off downloading images. I mean, I don't know what your perception of me is. But, I mean, you know, just to inform, I don't really look up porn too much, man. And it's like, a lot of the time, I'm just kind of chilling. And then if I see something nice, I'm like, oh, save. I'm lacking too. Yeah, man, my, I used to be way more on my game. I, I haven't really been doing much. This year, this year has been kind of like, well, not this year, but like, well, I, I guess I'll say like 2018, the hunt for the house has been kind of rough. Once everything goes down, then I guess I'll be in a more relaxed state and I'll be more open to trying new things. And just in general, looking up for more porn. The fact that Edgar has one gigabyte of hentai makes it seem like he's never had sex before. <laughs> really? Uh, do I look that innocent? Want to talk about traps? Don't look up Florin. My eyes. Oh, shit. I can imagine. There's way more stuff of him than Harold. How are there so many? You really gotta be joking. It, it appears the queen was right. There's an abnormal number of them here. But even for the great Zekinator, this is a tall order. But bro, we're at level 80. We can run them over. We can't leave them like this. They'll run rampant all over the world. Well, with you there, chum, it's time that we nip this in the bud. Here we go, Harold. Harold? I'm ready. Okay, let's do it, Harold. Is everything cool, my girl? The calm and the storm. Okay, here we go. We gotta beat 20 of these things? Jesus Christ! 
This is about to be a fucking clusterfuck. Harold, man, I hope you're gonna... I hope you're gonna be on our side for the rest of this fight, you know what I'm saying? Alright, here we go. Wait a minute, what the fuck? Oh, wait, my, I fucked up. Whoopsie. They look scary? Yeah, I know, right? They look so big. But they really don't mean shit. This game gives you huge enemies, and they, like... Don't worry, there's enemies that are far smaller. Those are the dangerous ones. Uh, I just gotta zoom it out, because I can't see shit. If I'm not battling as good as I could be, it's because I'm focusing on the stream chat, too. Can we react? Re react to Smash Switch? Alright. Get him, Azami. Erika, you should check Pixtip. There's a ton of Japanese artists that draw not safe for work and they don't post it on any other websites. Really? Pixtip? I've seen a lot of stuff from that website, though. I mean, who knows? Maybe I will make an account. I love the fucking Poppy Buster, man. This shit, this fucker is so funny. It's like, <laughs> the fact that the robot speaks perfect English and he interacts with the fucking Nopon, man, it's so, it's so random to me. I love this fucking blade, though. I thought that it was gonna, I feel a little bit, like, pissed off at the Poppy Buster, though. Because when they made it seem like, oh, you'll have a Poppy that anybody can use, I thought that meant that I had a Poppy that I can also modify with the fucking, um, with Poppy Swap. That would have been so cool if um, Poppy Buster was just a modifiable, you could just add mods to him and shit. But no, you can't. It's like he's stuck as defense tank, and even worse, with the fucking hammer. It's kind of like, oh, but oh well, I'm not going to complain too much. Get him, Poppy! Get him, Poppy! Very well, then. <laughs> this proper-ass fucking robot. Very well, then. Very well then. What the fuck? Why is the audio so weird? I'm a little confused by this audio, bro. Is it time? Something gonna go down or what? Yeah, things aren't looking so good here. Let's retreat for now and regroup. Retreat for now? Come on, Rex Rex. Niggas fucked them up. Wait, so there's a fourth form of Poppy? Yeah, this is the new Poppy Buster that came out a few days ago. Uh, let me see here. I gotta check my audio. Affirmative. Okay, let's go. Get out of here. What's up with my fucking audio? audio? Affirmative. Okay, let's go. Get out. Okay, we're good? Okay, it seems like audio is good. I don't know. It sounded a little weird at first. When did they add the new Poppy DLC? The 27th huh? this, this month. And they put in that um, Cosmos' sister, Telos. Another blade. Is something about to go down with Harold? It doesn't look like they're going to let this one go. Well then, let's kill them all. Oh, crud. We're completely surrounded. I can see this being dangerous if and we fucking... Keep on coming. Stranger X9, what's up, man? Thank you. Do not fear. I have sworn on my life to protect you. Alright, so we're in Harold. some trouble now. Hey, there's no way you could take on that many enemies on your own. What are you trying to pull? You about to release some, like, secret power or something? I had hoped I would never have to use this again. But don't betray us, man. Whoa. Whoa. Goodbye. Yo. Just blew them all the fuck back. Yo. Uh, excuse me, Harold. What's the deal? Yo! Harold, stop! That's enough! Stop fighting! Bro! Uh, uh. Can she not control the power? Baby girl is wilding right now. She's trying to take the team out? Baby girl! What does she do when Harold. she released her power or whatever? Why would that like make her a rampage and shit? Harold, are you alright? Is the dragon like on, on her trying to control moment. her? A few seconds more, and we'd have been toast, too. Can you walk? <sighs> That's enough. Harold, stay away! Yo. At this rate, I'm afraid my power will... 
It's just going to destroy everything. <clears throat> I I have to go. Somewhere. S somewhere no one will ever find me. Her voice like changed Herald, up, bro. Wait. Somewhere will never go. find me. <laughs> Harold's kind of bad, bro. <laughs> hey, listen, I'll, I'll just be real. Harold's kind of bad, bro. She's an Infinity Stone, bro. I, I can see that. Harold. She got the Power Stone. I guess. Well, that's the berserk state we were warned about. Most likely. Yeah, that's probably exactly how it went down when she wrecked the temple in Theoswar. And after we swore that we'd never let it happen again. Damn. Yep. And that was nobody's fault but our own. We pushed the girl too far. <sighs> we're going to find her. Naturally. There's no way we're leaving her alone out there. She's out there on her own because she doesn't want to cause us trouble. We can't just abandon her like that. Yeah, definitely not. But where the fuck is she right. flown off She's to? She suffered long enough. She needs a right royal cheering up. Come on, let's go before she gets too far. Right. She can move pretty let's fast. Go. Having said that, Hero does have wings. Yes, thank you, Morag. The logic. First, we'll have to find out where she's headed. Couldn't Mithra just use her heaven beams? Yeah, Harold, like. Going berserk wasn't necessary, but I guess she was like, you know what? Fuck it. I'll take the initiative. She just went for it. Ah, oh, man. All right. You know, I feel like having Tor back in the party, man. I miss this nigga. So, you know what? For now, Morag, take a seat. Fall back. Tor, get your ass in here. Let me see. I want to mod up the poppies. I'm going to give QT Pie the light element. Boom. All right. And uh, you, I want to give. Let's give you dark. No, no. Poppy QT operating at max power. And now for um, alpha, you're gonna get motherfucking. You're gonna get wind. Fuck it. Wait, hold on. Whoop. Meh, meh, meh. <laughs> Man, 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 indeed. All right, so we need electric and ice and earth. Okay, uh, I got earth on Wolfric. Um, actually, let's put um. Name on. I've been sharpening my fangs for this electric, day to come. Electric, electric. Uh, fuck it, it's core. It's been a long time coming. Always mm, cute and fierce, ice. though. Ooh, I was, uh, you know what? I won't Ursula. let you down. I hope, at least. Okay, and then um, Rex. I got Rex as a healer right now. Uh, you know what? Fuck it. Get 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 this nigga flooring. Thanks. I'll do my best. Do we have water. You know what? Yeah. Keep draw mark. Yeah, I think we're good. How does he have so many elemental cores? A lot of fucking Tora. Uh, excuse me, Tiger Tiger. Well, which is technically Tora Tora in Japanese. Um, yeah. Look at look at my fucking. Look at how many fucking ether crystals I have, bro. Like, I played that game so many times, I almost committed suicide one time. So how many side quests does that I have to do? Like 200 more? I have to do like um like maybe two pages or three pages worth, and then boom, we'll be good. Etika, I got one of your hype train shirts and it is lit. Thanks, man. Appreciate that shit. Thank you very, very much. That sure it seems like everybody liked it a lot. Find Harold in the Merc mission, Harold Search. Oh fuck, we gotta do Merc shit. Okay. Let's send some niggas to find her ass. Harold search. Um, we pushed her too hard. We can't abandon an important ally like that. So let's track her down. Indeed, man. Couldn't have said it better myself. Okay, where the fuck is my dragon chick? Well, I don't know. She's not really a dragon, is she? She kind of is, actually. Strength plus 35, bit ball, and ether cannon. Okay, I got a couple niggas that can do that. Boom. No Boom. Boom. I'm to carry out my a bit, bit ball. I call I'll it the bitch ball. I'll Expeditionist, and uh, we need someone with a foot fetish. Who's got a foot fetish here? There's got to be at least one person in here that likes them toesies. <laughs> I just make fun of it. It's, it's fleet of foot. I know what that means. It doesn't mean a foot fetish. I'm just making a joke. 
Where is it? Fleet of foot. Is that something that a regular common blade can have? Maybe it's not. Maybe it's not. I think I only stopped playing this game because maxing Ursula's chart made me want to kill <laughs> It made me want to kill myself too. I almost took myself out maybe like four times. <laughs> what the fucking Ursula? <laughs> okay, I guess I can't fucking... I guess commons don't really have that. Alright, let me see here. Someone must have it. Okay, here we go. Um, we'll just throw Boreas's bitch out. Oh, yeah, Boreas! Of course he was. That's his shit. Fuck it, go ahead. Find her. We'll be the voracious Vanguard! Hey ho! Good luck! I feel like a character like Boreas, I've seen his archetype before, and I can't remember from where. But I feel like I've seen a character like that before. Yo, Stranger X9, thank you for coming through, man. I always get you and Styles mixed up. Alright, so that's a 10 minute wait. We can do that. While we're waiting for Harold to get her ass found, we can, um, maybe we can do a different quest. Maybe we can continue this girl power quest that Rex got himself mixed into. You know what, let's make that the focus for now. Yeah, the girl power off, man. You know what, why delay it, right? Let's see what happens. Set this as an active one. Etiko, are you caught up with my hero? No, I am not. Um, I, I haven't really thought to watch it too much, man. I know it's really popular, and I know, like, that's the way, but I mean, eh, I haven't really been on it. I feel like I'm, that's, that's part of why I'm getting older. Because I just don't feel like keeping up with all the fucking hot shit. Or I will eventually. I will eventually. But, you know, it's just like the focus is a little different for me at the moment. At the moment. Um, did you hear about the guy who died watching Infinity War in India? Yo, I heard. Nigga had a fucking heart attack or something? That's fucking horrible, man. All right, where do we have to go for this quest? Tanta. Go to the table in Anastasia's. Okay. Let's it go. Hmm. Like his Boreas has a gold shiny portrait around his icon. That's like one of the um. You can like lock a blade. I finished him, so I just have his uh, um lock. My dream is to show up in New York City and drink yo. I out drink your bitch ass. Oh really, X9? I, oh, you're more than welcome to the challenge, bro. I'm open to that. <laughs> Damn, Thanos took a nigga from our universe too. Take my head. Oh, you mean you mean fucking uh Harold? Hmm, do you know who has a chatterbait? I have one. I have a point up too. Wait, was there a heart to heart around here that we could do? No, that's not a heart to heart. That, that, that's, that's, um. Equip all the blades with a girl talk. Oh, okay, okay, okay. You know what? I guess I'm gonna have to ship the party around a little bit. Girl talk blades. Um, Rex, uh, we got you with Mithra. Um, we have fucking, um. Here we go. We have. Just to make sure. Uh, we got Praxis. For this. Who else has girl talk? I think Pandoria? You know, we can we can throw that on, Zeke. I just switch up my party, too. Fuck. Um, doesn't really matter, though. I'm kind of over level. It doesn't really matter what the party composition is. I'm going to be running through everything. Oh, wait, no. Pandoria doesn't have girl's talk. Whoops. I forgot. Oh, fucking Vale has girl's talk? Oh, really? Oh, so I just fucking... Gave Pandora to him for no reason. Alright, well, we gotta shake her off now. Ah, oh, come on now. It's been a long okay, time. Okay, get Pandy off Always of Zeke, fierce, please. please. be good to me. Okay, so Veil. Vale. My blood boils. Um, I guess Cora in general. Time coming. Um, who fierce, else though. has girls? I think uh, Sheba has it. For our banquets? Uh, let me see. Who else? Not Pandy. I don't think Nia had that shit. Mm. Damn, that was it? Shit. I thought there were more. Edgar doesn't like watching good things. <laughs> Real funny. Just in the moment. And the ending of Dragon Ball Super. Um, One Punch. Oh, yeah. Dragon Ball Super. I walk. You know, it's Dragon Ball, man. That's fucking that's quintessential to existence, bro. Of course I did. Uh, let me see. Did I, am I missing anybody? Thanos actually destroyed the universe because a girl told him to. It, or the girl told him his dick was small. Yeah, from the comic books you're talking, right? There's so many fucking girl blades in this game, man. Like, what the fuck? Alright, I think I got them all. Sheba, um, Praxis, Mithra, Korra. Uh, yeah, I think that's all of them. 
I really wish that um, Azami was in there. I don't know what the purpose is going to be, but hey, fuck it. We're going to put them all in and see what happens. And Dahlia. I wish you had too. I mean, I'm, I'm curious. I like Dahlia. I, I like them all, man. All these girls, man. Fuck it. All right, I'm going to save the game. Let's see what happens. Edic is going to finish Xenoblade on his deathbed at this rate, probably. <laughs> yeah, I like this game. I feel like if I, once I beat this game, there isn't going to be much else for me to really play to be interested as much. I mean, but then again, I'm getting kind of tired of like having this game dragged out. Like, I want to try out some other stuff, too. So, you know, we'll see. Okay, so I see you have not run away yet. Well done. I'm proud of you. Al contraire, my little... Uh, how do you say Al contraire? My little croissant, it is I who am proud of you. Yo, Korra is so fucking feisty, man. I love this chick. <laughs> Etika should check out in in Yashiki. I want to see his reactions. Where's a cheap place to stay in New York City, Etika? <laughs> Nowhere, nigga. <laughs> Fuck, everything's expensive. Especially now that it's summertime. Hotel season is crazy overpriced. Airbnb, super fucking expensive. You're not going to find anywhere underneath $300 minimum. In hotels, same shit, bro. Maybe $400 per night this shit is raw you're gonna probably have to fucking stay at a hostel or some shit i mean there's ways you can probably go on craigslist and find a nigga who's willing to give you his couch for like maybe a hundred a night but i mean you're gonna have to deal with some shit man i thought you'd be turning tail at the threat of taking on my relentless girl power god almighty what are the japanese in japanese like what, what, what were they actually saying it, there's no way that they were saying girl power in japanese you better not underestimate me cora you're the one that's going to be routed by my awesome girl power with capitals. Tee hee hee. Oh, Mithra, no. You did not just do that. Ah ha ha ha. Okay. Well, we agreed we're going to need to put it to the test. Let's decide how. Indeed, we must. I haven't really given it much thought, though. How about this? We'll get a few people to act as judges, and it'll be their job to decide who's got the most GP. And it'll be our job to persuade them we have more of it than the other one does. Does that sound fair to you? Oh, maybe charm or beauty yeah probably something like that they could have just used that but i guess they wanted like a little bit more of a catchphrase um core's personality is kind of similar to tracer i guess i haven't really seen much of tracer's personality outside of like the overwatch references and gameplay stuff that she says in the middle oh absolutely i love girl talk i'm very confident about this well, let's grab someone walking by, and the real battle can begin. So they're going to really try to pick up niggas outside, bro? <laughs> if it was me, I'd be like, oh, hell yeah. <laughs> who's, who, who's trying to get it? Who's trying to get it? Brace yourself. Wow, this is a piece of cake. They're picking up random niggas outside, bro. Do you think that we'll get a kid Icarus after Smash 5 or Sakurai done with games? I hope we do. Okay, first up. Right. Sheba! Let us turn uh -huh. this farce into oh, a Lord. Okay. Okay. Mithra continued what the fuck <laughs> i've never heard what they say with their girl talk shit before so this is the first nia just the person you're right on time etika you gonna play god of war probably not there's a lot i'm doing right now but maybe later on you you know it could happen maybe later um you're right on time hey cora mithra what do you even mean by that dare i even ask we're having a showdown we want to determine who's got the most gp a girl power up. <laughs> she Mithra's really going all with it, bro. She doesn't even care. She, she's usually all like, you know, trying to act all high and mighty. But right now, she's in the fucking muck. And she's like completely... It's like she's oblivious to how fucking silly she sounds. Why are these girls so bad, my boy? Oh, man. <laughs> Listen, you saw what I... A few minutes you know, earlier in the stream. You saw how many pictures I saved. <laughs> Nigga. The fu fuck my life. Girl power equal to how good they can give hand jobs. Oh no, nigga, you ain't playing. Yeah, probably not. I mean, hey, I can't like obviously, I can't obviously can't like. There's been times where I played arms. I play arms now. I play it frequently now. Like, I mean, dude, something just hit me and it was like, let me let me try to play arms again. And then, and I like it, dude. I I've been playing. I've been like getting used to the controls and how to like turn the punches in mid turn. Like, it, it, arms is fun to me now. So I mean, a game that I kind of looked down on for like a year. Out of nowhere, I'm just like, fuck it. And I've been playing it since, like, maybe a month now. I don't know. That's how it is, man. Sometimes things just go and come into fashion with people. You know what I'm saying? Um, just take a seat here, would you? And now tell us, who has the most girl power? Mithra or me? We want me to... Uh, okay, fine. I have time. Whatever. Let's get to it. But how are we going to take other um how are you going to take each other on exactly well we thought that we would try girl talk first just tell us who's got the most girly talk in terms of content and delivery i got it so for the first topic it's a bit basic but how about favorite food 
It sounds good. Let's get started at last. So now, Nia, tell me, what's your favorite? Oh, I'm on the spot now. I guess cream orange paratha. Oh, really? I didn't think you had such adorable taste. She's pouring it on. Mithra, don't act all extra. We know how you are when the fucking cameras are off. I don't care. I just eat stuff I like. Now I do what I want indeed. Um, I'm just surprised, that's all. I thought you'd be more of a meat and fish sort of girl because you're a fucking cat. Nah, that's a bit boring for me. Play Monster Hunter. Eh, I'm not really a Monster Hunter guy. Um, they're going to have sex at the end. Whoever comes first loses. <laughs> that's what I knew it was going to be. This whole game's a hot em. You said you wanted to do the Nintendo challenge. What the fuck is that? When you speak as Nia, try to imitate her voice. I've never done that, never will. That, to me, that shit is cringe as fuck. It's stupid. Um, but that's just my opinion. So, Nia, I'd like to ask you something. Um, <laughs> oh, I guess I could imitate her accent. Feel your boots. <laughs> Here I come, ready or go not. <laughs> Nia's fucking hilarious. Fill your boots. What do you think of Dromark? I mean, as a man cat. A cat man? Man cat. <laughs> you mean bestiality? They're trying to fuck? I don't think Nia, I think she's technically a, a person. Like, why would Nia want to fuck Dromark? Where did that come from? I thought we were talking about food. That's so weird. <laughs> Well, when girls get together, this is the stuff we really want to know. Ni oh my god, they think me is fucking Dromark? Wow. Do you like Zeke or Rex better? I like them both a lot, but I guess I prefer Rex a little bit. Just a little bit. God damn. Um, if you're talking about like personality and just story, like yeah, I say Rex a little bit, but I like Zeke a lot. Um, this kind of girls only banter is an important component of girl power near um, Well, I wasn't trying to win or anything. I'm just really interested in you Like he's always following you around like my lady my lady and now I kind of thought what's up with that? Well, I don't really give it much thought he awakened and we started he just started talking to me like that So what but I mean um, you must have noticed that he's a man or you know male I mean, oh my god, they're cut into the chase, bro is it more worth it to take my car and drive there or and sleep in my car? Well, that's what fucking C and D did. I mean, but yeah, New York is expansive, bro. I mean, you, you gotta you gotta plan ahead if you're trying to stay here for some shit. Um, we're just kind of joined at the hip, but that just makes me think of him as like a butler or a parent or something. He's a bit of a nag sometimes, but he's just looking out for me, I think. But wait, why am I telling you this shit? Enough, I'm out. Nia's like, wait a second, I got caught. No, it was just getting good, too. No, it wasn't, Cora. They weren't... Nia and Dromark aren't fucking each other. This ain't no bestiality. What do you think this is, motherless? Um, the judge walked out, so this one's a draw. Okay, let's try another one. Another one. What's the hot topic right now? Right. Let's see who they're gonna we'll find. Turn this farce into a three-act yeah. comedy. Okay. Oh, yeah, right. And so, thanks to the beautiful Mithra, the tale continued. Oh, Lord. It's kind of quiet. It looks like everyone's hanging back in their rooms. No, everyone's scared, of course. Well, as we pass time, why don't you ask me what my favorite food is? Okay, what is it? It's blossom custard. I like the little flowers inside, and it's got this wobbly texture. It's like fucking um, puri puri. Giga puri. <laughs> it's smooth and sweet when it hits the tongue. Okay, now you're making my dick <laughs> I'm kidding, I'm kidding. Yeah, I don't think that it would be hyperbole to say that foods like blossom custard boost my GP by a thousand. Hey, come on, you're exaggerating again. Well, what about you? For me, it's got to be cloud sea crab sticks. Seriously. Yeah, man, crunchy on the outside, soft on the inside, bro. Uh, that sounds delicious. If you ask me, it's the best way to get the full flavor of the sea crab. Oh, come on, man. You can't really. Crab sticks? They're just a bit, uh, savage. But to be honest, they're the kind of thing that brings down your girl power instead of boosting it. Why? Because it's all fucking, you know, it's like oily or some shit. Uh, ew. Boost, gay, boost their gay pride by 1,000%. Oh, yeah. GP, nigga. Fuck. <laughs> Honestly, I'm just coming to party with you unless you know something big in New York City. The timing really depends, too, man. Uh, let me see. Wait, what's wrong with Cloud C crab sticks? They're lovely. Cora. Don't you think that you're going crazy over sweet things? Wait, don't you think going crazy over sweet things is a bit basic? Well, in my honest opinion, they're a lot better than fishy old crab sticks. I think we can both agree that I won this round. I've got the most GP. I think not. I think we can hardly declare a winner without a judge. 
And this wasn't a proper test. It's like chit chat. Don't make up rules like that. I guess you're right. Okay. Doesn't look like anyone's gonna show up though. But we gotta settle this. Well, my friend Smash comes out soon. Y'all motherfuckers will be able to go straight to the fucking straight to the fucking cat fight. Two hours passed. Damn. To a three act yeah. comedy. Okay. Oh, yeah, right. And so, thanks to the beautiful Mithra, the tale continued. Wait a minute, <laughs> Camarero. <laughs> Damn, well, you told me how to say your name, and I fucking forgot again. Um, but come, fuck it, come, <laughs> Commandero. He's saying crunchy on the outside, meaty on the inside, like an old man's dick. That's a fucking what? What man has a crunchy penis? That sounds fucking disgusting. the child no Cora Mithra don't subject Poppy to the don't corrupt her hello Mithra hello Cora what are Mithra and Cora doing Poppy you turned up at just the right time as it happens Cora and I are facing off to see who's got GP we want to ask you to judge understood Poppy here to <laughs> Poppy run as fast as you can my girl Poppy's just the sort to give us an impartial measurement on our girl power my god, anything this summer or fall? Um, not sh not sure, man. It's a, I don't really know. That, those kinds of things, they just pop up randomly. Um, Poppy's the sort of... To get, I'm going places. I'm going places. But New York, man, eh, I don't really know. It's the sort to give us an impartial measurement of our girl power. Indeed. Now, okay, we can talk about some real girl stuff now. Who, who we're into? Poppy shouldn't be here for this, man. Cora, can't you change the topic up a bit? You're obsessed with this. Oh, and Mithra, she doesn't want to fucking talk about Rex and shit, so she's like nervous. She's like, I don't want to talk about who I'm into, nigga. Poppy needs to transform into Cutie Pie, and she'll fit in. Yeah, there we go. Why is she in her basic? Why is Poppy sitting? <laughs> what the fuck is this? Poppy's like, <laughs> what? Bob, how Poppy just? I can't even sit like that. She's doing like a fucking plank sitting thing. She just. Fucking stiff as a board, bro. What the fuck is up with her? <laughs> There's everything about Poppy customized. You did not just ask me that question, bro. Jat, man, you need to chill, my boy. You could, you said it. You fucking said it. Poppy got the T pose of sitting. I know. What is this, Poppy? You relax. You can let loose a little bit. I know you're nervous about this situation, but I mean, come on, loosen up. They had the bunny armor. Poppy's actually customizable in everything. Legit. Yeah, everything regarding combat. Nothing else. Niggas. Poppy ready for Master Pawn? Shut up, niggas. Y'all need to stop. Hey, I'd be pretty curious to see about how you would answer that, Poppy. Poppy not really sure what Cora's talking about. But we're telling each other who our special someone is. I mean, like, who do you like? Uh-oh. Poppy like everyone. Poppy like everyone. Nah, that's not what she means. Poppy think girl power have other aspects, like organizing life and fulfilling girl. Excuse me, and fulfilling goals. Wow, Poppy's Poppy's woke, my nigga. Poppy have extensive subroutines and software libraries for making life successful. Based on criteria like task completion, punctuality, and efficiency, Poppy have much girl power. Yeah. Yeah. She definitely does. Yeah, I seem to have a bit of a blind spot for that sort of thing. You mean actual substance in life? So according to Poppy's calculations, winner is Poppy. Please applaud. <laughs> Fucking Christ. <laughs> we can't settle it like that. Yeah, we've got no hope of winning against Poppy's robotic brain. Looks like another draw. Yup. Yeah, they were fucked from Jump Street. Why Poppy look like a blow-up doll? Stop it. In Smash 5, Mithra's taunt is going to be her saying Etika likes Minecraft. Fuck all of you. All right, for the next topic. All right, let us uh -huh. turn this farce into a three-act yeah. comedy. Okay. Oh, yeah, right. And so, thanks to the beautiful Mithra, the tale continued. Oh, my lord. Poppy came in as the judge and declared herself as the winner. Yo, how the fuck she came through so savage? She was like, you know what? I'm better than all you basic-ass bitches. You're talking about men that you like, and I'm talking about fulfilling life goals and having substance to character. Poppy wins by default. Fuck you. Oh, Mithra and Cora, could you be in the midst of your big girl off? <laughs> girl off, that sounds like a fucking lesbian um, sex group. Pandoria, we gotta have you judge us on our GP skills. Sounds fun, I'm game. Now this should be interesting. 
what did we talk about? Well, we talked about favorite foods and romance. Well, not really. We didn't go into details about the romance. Romance talk, huh? So, do you two have a certain special someone in your sights? I'm curious about Cora, since you don't really have... Damn, Cora's a... Cora... Jesus Christ almighty. Let's just take a moment to just give Cora props. Her girl power is definitely on point. That's a bad fucking girl, man. I mean, Mithra's baby girl, but Cora's a... Cora's temptation right there. That's a fucking... That, that's, a, that's, a, that's a treat right there. You know what I'm saying? Like, I'm just talking about looks, bro. Cora got it going on, man. You two got a certain special someone in your sights? Well, that's certainly an interesting topic you're in uh no there's no one i swear bro you can't just flip flop i did that quest where she was like yo rex when are you gonna pop the question and it was he was like uh maybe no time soon i mean i don't know and she was like come on dude you got me waiting and shit i'm trying to get married nigga ask me to marry you already and he was like fuck man this i saw i did that quest they watched somebody else get married and the myth was like yo you need to fucking throw the ring on it already and he, he's like damn i'm just a child i'm a boy i can't marry you yet <laughs> and now she's acting like there ain't nobody what are you talking about man cora has got the kind of body mass of a toothpick <laughs> Well, it's, in, it's at the top and the bottom, you know, that's a thick-ass toothpick. Um, there's no one, I swear. Well, what about you, Pandoria? Who do you like? Yeah, fess up. It's time to talk. What about Zeke? You think that could go somewhere? No, I don't think of the prince like that. He's so pig-headed and insensitive. Nothing gets through to him. Well, I think you must have been paying a fair bit of attention to him to make an observation like that. Oh, of course, because she's looking. She's like, damn it, he, cause he, he doesn't get any of my signals. Fuck it. <laughs> well, you must have been throwing signals in order to get to that conclusion. Panties, thighs, and ass got me sweating through the entire game, bro. Listen, this whole game's got me sweating, man. This whole thing's a goddamn this a clusterfuck. Um, come on, what do you really think about the old Zekanator? Spill it. No, I won't. I won't tell you. Man, no one's... We're not getting anywhere with this. We're supposed to be finding out juicy details, man. No one's talking. She's surprisingly shy, huh? Well, we lost another judge. I guess it's another draw. Can't be helped. Let's keep it moving, man. Fuck. The Zekanator will always be the best. Of course, man. It's nearly the next day. These motherfucking chicks have been sitting in this goddamn restaurant for 24 hours? All right. Let us uh -huh. turn this farce into a three-act right, yeah. comedy. Okay. Oh, yeah, right. And so, thanks to the beautiful Mithra, the tale continued. Who's going to have to do the dance? Because they said whoever loses in the girl power decision making is going to have to um, perform a show for niggas. And I think I know what kind of a show it's going to be. Rex Rex is going to be in the fucking club throwing bands, man. Niggas about to be... <laughs> <laughs> What's it? They got gold in this game, bro. My nigga Rex is about to be throwing out a whole bunch of core crystals, bro. He's about to be. <laughs> there we go. If we keep drawing, we're never going to be able to find a winner. Hey, Core. Uh oh, we got Praxis. That's baby girl. Yo, Praxis is my homegirl. I feel like her and Theory's voice should be reversed, but I mean, she's fucking great, man. This should be funny. Um, hey, Mithra, Cora, you two been chatting here the whole time? Actually, we're trying to work out which one of us has the most GP. Yeah, Praxis, could you, um, adjudicate? Oh, yeah, I know that word. Adjudicate for us. Hey, wait a second. Are you sure we should ask Praxis? I mean, maybe we should ask someone who's a bit more girly. Hold on a second. Just because of the eye patch, don't you for a second question Praxis's femininity, okay? That's a fuck. That's baby girl status. There's a lot of girls in this game that are baby girl to me. Fucking Christ almighty. But Praxis got it going on. Um, what did you just say, my nigga? Yeah, perhaps she's not the best candidate. Oh, someone's about to scrap. If I'm being honest, she's probably not up to the task. Okay, so maybe they're just trying to bait her so that way she stays with the fucking task instead of running away. Yeah, she dissed the fuck out of her. Yo, I'm telling you, someone, we are about to watch a motherfucker get slapped down. No need to be a bitch to practice. They're talking shit about her, bro, about my girl. Hey, you don't have to keep going on and on about it, you know. Anyways, if it's girl power you're after, I'll have you know that I have plenty. More, in fact. Uh-oh. No way. But you're so untidy and you're always losing things in your mess. And when you eat, the food goes everywhere. <laughs> oh, shit. Well, you know what? That's why I like when girls make a mess when they eat, bro. Listen, I like it messy. <laughs> look, look. <laughs> 
if it ain't messy, it ain't being done right. Okay, bro? <laughs> fellas, can y'all agree with me? Can I get an amen in the chat, please, fellas? It's got to be messy. <laughs> I want spit, slobber, everything. <laughs> I need to be fucking euthanized. You think girl power is all about waltzing about like a little butterfly? No, it's about being true to yourself. Whoa, now we're having lot. This is knowledge right here. Wait, don't you think that means you don't have much girl? Mithra! You really said that? Yeah, yeah. You always do. Yo, Praxis, you need to you need to beat someone's ass now, or at least get in her face. You don't let these motherfuckers talk to you like that. I tell you what, you two can just figure out a winner amongst yourselves. What a couple of jerks! I had enough. Real shit. Maybe we did say a bit too much there. Yeah, man. Yeah, you know, Praxis, you just got so many points, man. She was like, y'all are some fucking assholes, man. I ain't gotta deal with this shit. Screw your contest. Fuck off, man. And good luck, bitch. She fucking did. Yo, they roasted the fuck out of her, though. They got at her ass, man. She said, girl power is about being true to yourself. And then that's when Mithra was like, well, I guess you don't have much. <laughs> what? <laughs> she didn't even diss her on, like, her looks or, like, her acting girly. She dissed her whole persona, her life, her personality, her everything. She said, it's about being true to yourself. Well, you ain't got much, bitch. Like, what? She leaping into the bath, but no one ran any water. Messy. Oh, fuck. Edda's gonna eat a full course meal while eating the pussy. I'm not on my callus shit, bro. I get it. <laughs> it's here. This is me. This is the pussy. This is me, nigga. I'm here. This is the pussy. This is... I'm here, nigga. I'm going into the neck. I'm... I'm, fucking... I'm fucking going into the neck. This is me inside. I'm just. <laughs> I need me some scuba gear. I put the fucking thing on my. All right. <laughs> Diving, <laughs> diving in, bro. <laughs> Nigga, I'm gonna need a fucking. I need an oxygen tank on my back. <laughs> That's how deep I'm gonna go. I'm going Mariana's trench in the pussy, nigga. <sighs> I, I, I really need to be shot. You're supposed to stick the other head in the pussy, not the one with the flat top. <laughs> Maybe I got a flat top growing down here too. You just don't know it. What if I cut my pubes to form a fucking high top fade? And at this point, it's grown like tall to the point where it like protrudes from my body. You never know. I pull it out, baby girl be like, what the fuck, nigga? <laughs> maybe we did say too much there. Well, maybe we should take her a little something later to make up for it. Yeah, I think so. Okay, at least they both acknowledged that they were fucked up. That really was fucked up. Etika go full neck. I'm on full body. I'm stepping all the way. <laughs> this the fool. <laughs> this the fool. I'm stepping in, bro. I'm just fucking like, whoop. Excuse me. So now, so the thing that everyone's talking about right now is, right. let's see what's up. Let us turn uh -huh. this farce into a three-act yeah. comedy. Okay. Oh yeah, right. And so, thanks to the beautiful Mithra. I've seen it on 4chan, I can confirm. Real shit, man. Real shit. <laughs> Ariel's like, <laughs> I'm stepping in, bro. No one's coming past. And waiting for someone's no good. Let's go and look for someone, okay. These girls are going to get themselves in trouble. Oh, shit, Bridget. Hello, you two. Are you taking a little constitutional? Is that what you're doing? Why, yes. I always take a little stroll in the night. It aids sleep. Really? Bridget, we want to ask you a favor. Would you mind chatting with us for a bit and telling which one of us has the most girl power? Bridget's about to shit on both of y'all. That's, that's a woman. That's a woman right there. No little girl shit, man. Etika going into the pussy on some Narnia wardrobe type shit. Just, oh, <laughs> just for a whole world. Listen, man. Descend into the pool, man. Motherfucking depression into the pool. She's coming for the big titty mom, bro. She's going for, she's aiming for the juggler, bro. You better watch your words here. Oh, a thrilling contest. Oh, I'm sure, certainly. I'd be happy to join in. Thank you. Well, since we have Bridget here, should we talk about beauty? Yeah, that's a topic I'm pretty confident on. Okay. My cleanse tone and moisture, um, excuse me, my cleanse tone and moisturize routine takes some beating, I tell you. And I'm always practicing throwing cute poses in front of the mirror on some, hi, <laughs> oh God. Too bad Bridget, Bridget is too busy 
scissoring with Morag. You know, they actually bought up some lesbian stuff with Bridget um, in a prior Heart to Heart or some quest that I've done. And they were like, uh, Bridget was like, no, I, I'm not I'm not with that, bro. I, I like niggas. I like dick niggas. <laughs> but, and, and she cleared that up, at least. And Morag, she seems pretty damn pissed off whenever she gets equivalated to, like, a man. I think more man, that's a woman, bro. She likes dick, too. <laughs> I mean, hey, it, it doesn't matter. I mean, if you like pussy, you like pussy, too. It doesn't matter. I mean, you know, I'm just going to clarify. I would clarify. But they were saying, like, uh, no, I'm not like that. <laughs> like funny oh yeah didn't bridget turn down sheba and she was like yo i'm not no bro like, what the fuck i'm always practicing throwing cute poses if i may Ooh, i'm not sure beauty is something you practice it's something you radiate from within okay tell her tell her hikari i don't really think i need to go to those lengths to look good i always aim for new heights it's like one of my life goals ever onward always pushing the very boundaries of beauty okay she could easily catch it Cora is kind of sexy no no Cora's a bad Cora's a bad girl man I wish there is there is there is there a rule 34 of Cora out there bro y'all motherfuckers need to keep me informed let me open up my damn Twitter so I can re see what the responses of the motherfuckers in here are saying bro I need to see what the deal is why are you streaming so late nigga I don't fucking know I shouldn't be actually I should be going to sleep this is mine, 35 gigs and counting. Nigga got a 35 gig porn folder. Bro, what kind of shit do you even have in there? If y'all find any fucking Rule 34 of any of the characters that I mentioned, Korra, Harold, by all means, I'm an open book. I'm ready for it. <laughs> um, certainly, it's good to set yourself goals. A little healthy rivalry doesn't hurt either. But of course, the rivalry should always be handled graciously. So I'd say that this one's a draw. What? I think you both need to grow spiritually a little bit before you can really hold forth about beauty. Wow. It's true, though. Bridget, tell these little girls, man. They're getting all excited and uppity uppity. Wait for it. Bridget, that's some. She's a little bit more mature. All right. Let us uh -huh. turn this farce into a right. three act comedy. Okay. Oh, yeah, right. And so, thanks to the beautiful Mithra, the tale continued. Um. Ariel says, I don't really wear makeup, but I always catch niggas gawking. Hey, man, that's how you know you're doing it right. Hey, silence. Uh-oh, Sheba's coming through, man. All right, we ready for our um, we ready for our harem chick? What she got to say? You have disturbed the royal slumber. This we cannot forgive, even if you are way cute. <laughs> it's really not good for your looks to stay up like this. For our sake, why don't you go to bed yourselves? As a matter of fact, do one better and come to our bed. <laughs> that way we can help to soothe you to sleep. Oh yeah, I know you would, Sheba. Mithra and I are trying to see who has the most GP. Well, we think you ought to have included us from the start, but it sounds fun nevertheless. We want you to judge which one of us has the most. Very well, we'll oversee your contest. Oh man, let's see here. Um, what's gonna happen? I'm just looking through my shit real quick. Uh, nothing else going on really. Nothing else. Thanks for the fucking um. Thanks for the likes and shit on Twitter though. All right, let's get down to it. Let's talk about who we are into. Wow, that's really all that you think about. Here we go. We got this going on with our resident um with our res resident lesbian in the group. Basically, that's basically what it is. So, Sheba, tell us what qualities your ideal man would have. Let's go. <laughs> She's about to shit on it. Uh, yeah, I mean, you only like girls, so I'd be interested to hear what kind of guy you'd be into, if you were into men, that is. Well, we suppose that a man must be financially solvent. Financially solvent. His pockets must be on top. Yes, who likes to share? But, of course, we can imagine that there are other, other vital traits. If we were interested, excellent manners and breeding... Excuse me, my boy? Wow. Straight up? Okay. <laughs> Fuck it. She said, you know, he's got to be packing. The niggas got to have a schlong ready to launch me to the moon. Otherwise, what's the point? Deep pockets and a deep penis, too. For example, he needs to know how to serve tea, scrub a bathtub, and have a nice villa by the lake. You know what, man? Shiva. <laughs> Shiva, fuck it. You can tell me. You can boss me around. I'll do it. I'm into that shit, man. <laughs> Listen, I wouldn't mind. Okay. Uh, yeah, I, I, I kind of, you know, I kind of get off to those fantasies of like um, a dude being subservient to a chick, like some kind of slave boy princess shit, and she's like, oh, bring me my, bring me my blah blah blah, or you know, like he's serving her and shit, and the dude is like fucking. <laughs> 
that's one that's one of the fantasies right there man and then she's like hmm, you've worked well today i'll give you your reward and she just boom <laughs> she just busted open she just take his head boom and he's just and he has to do it he's he's working for it the dude's a butler bro and he's just going to town <laughs> that's a fantasy bro i'm into that hey listen i'm being real right now i'm telling you y'all sponsors y'all paid to hear information like this i'll tell you straight up that's a fetish nigga <sighs> Like that fucking fed, that subservient type shit. Not to the crazy extent like some people do, but I mean, you know, that's my that's my shit right there. That's my shit. I can't help it. Don't you think that's a little That's a lot, Sheba. You're really setting the bar high for us girls. Well, it's just as well that we prefer girls. The man who would meet our requirements would be a rare creature. We've not really managed to storm wait, talk up a storm so far. Well, we maybe really haven't had the best partners either. Well, I'm sure the next one will be better. Okay, hopefully. Once the Switch gets hacked, we can mod the game for some naked models. God damn. <laughs> Bro, that, 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 that's too much technology, man. I know we have the power, but it's like, whoa. It's like, whoosh. 3 o'clock? It's 3 a.m. You girls have been sitting out here for how long? I feel like I only just got started. Right. Y'all are crazy. Let us uh -huh. turn this farce into a three-act yeah. comedy. Okay. Oh, yeah, right. And so, thanks to the beautiful Mithra, the tale continues. Hmm. Hey, hold on a second. TCO, he says, um, Etika testing. I got some sauce on Cora. Well, that's not Cora, but I guess you just wanted to see if the thing would go through. Yeah, it, it went through. I, that's a great image right there. I love it. Um, let's go back to the game. Well, I heard from Nia about your little contest. Are you still at it? Okay, we got another woman coming through. Morag is about the shit. Yeah, that's all good. Maybe you can judge us on this shit, Morag. Well, I only came here to get some water, <laughs> but of course, why? Morag's like, oh, okay, nigga. Have a seat, Morag. This shit's about to get serious. Do you ever desire a bit of romance? Well, she's so busy with her um, duties of being, like, you know, the Flamebringer's driver and shit. I am a soldier of the Ardanian Empire. Romance would divert valuable time away from perfecting my military arts. You're as predictable as ever, Morag. Don't you get sick of all that fighting? Don't you want to snuggle up with somebody warm at night? No, as it happens. Nothing beats cultivating one's character together with one's friends. Holy shit, they talk, 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 and get nowhere. I know, this is all talk, but I'm having fun. This is great. It's an enjoyable and worthwhile activity. That's how I always, always, look, that's how I always looked at it. Well, you take life too seriously. Don't you ever want to take a break? Let the inner child have some fun? No, not at all. To be honest, I think you and all the blades here are lacking dedication. If you were Ardanian army blades, you'd be living a much more focused life. I can tell you that. Ardanian Blades would never stay up half the night in frivolous chatter. They would rest up for the next day. A first-rate fighter never lets up on her training. Morag later in life is going to be a wild chick. Because all this fucking straight-edge living, bro. The kid in you, the wild in you, the animal in you is going to come out at some point in your life. Whether you want it to or not. So if you're denying that shit for years and years and years. Later in life, bro. <laughs> boom! <laughs> That's just what I'm saying, though. This applies to, wow, I just had some crazy shit pop up in my fucking Twitter. Oh my god, there is porn of Lady Morag. Wow, that's, that's a safe. Damn, bro. I've never seen that before. That's a damn good image, man. Thank you. I appreciate that, man. This applies all the more when you're young. You gotta be strict with your routine and rid yourself of bad habits. It's so boring to be serious all the time. Yeah, man, I've done that shit at some point, man. It's like... Fuck, where's the fun at? Morag? Yeah, you get your point across pretty clearly there, Morag. Thanks a lot. No, I haven't finished yet. You two need to reaffirm your commitment to the warrior life. She's wildin'. And you should sit there quietly and listen and don't even think about running off. What? Uh-oh. Morag, wait till you meet that dude that's gonna motherfucking make you hot. <laughs> you're gonna be around, you're gonna be like, oh, fuck. <laughs> why Why am I, ha why I have these butterflies in my stomach? She's gonna be like, uh... <laughs> <laughs> Fuck, I can't wait. I wish I could see that day. Uh, this is actually getting kind of stale, but I can't pull out now. All right. Let's keep going, bro. Let's turn uh -huh. this farce into a three act yeah. comedy. Okay. Oh, yeah, right. And so, thanks to the beautiful Mithra, the tale continued. It just goes on and on. Can't pull out now, of course. Zeke is around 25 as well. Yeah, these motherfuckers, they're like around my temp. My con well, the older um, characters are like around my temp uh, contemporaries. I'm really quite tired now. Yeah, me too. But this is exactly the sort of time that you need to be able to perk yourself up. 
Well, there's no one here. Why don't we talk about fashion or something to pass the time? Sure, why not? Accessories. I love accessories. I mean, I like wearing them, of course, but just looking at them is fun, too. What kind of things do you like, Cora? Well, I'm really into flowers. Flowers are so pretty, cute, and stylish. I feel kind of healed whenever I look at them. They are great worn in the hair. Well, don't you think that's a little bit childish, though? Childish or not, I like what I like, and there's no change in that. I'd say that's a win to me. Hey, that's not fair. I'm cuter. I should win. Well, you're a poor loser, Cora. But there's no one here to judge. We can't decide who won with no judge. Let's call in another fucking draw, then. It's starting to look like we might not be able to find a winner. Well, fuck it. If someone... If this is all a draw, then hell, both these girls dance. I don't care. Bands will make her dance. Nigga, Etika will make her dance. It's morning already, and I've got a real humdinger of a zinger for you that'll perk you up like hot java. It's... Uh -huh. Turn this farce into a three-act yeah. comedy. Okay. Oh, yeah, right. And so, thanks to the beautiful Mithra, the tale continued. They are really serious about this, man. These motherfuckers aren't backing down. Oh, it's Vale. Okay, the sadistic waifu. You still up? Yeah, man, we're trying to figure out who has the most girl power, and we're comparing our girl talk skills. Vale, since you're here, will you be our judge? Ah, eh, sure, I'll be fair and frank. You look great even in the middle of the night, Vale. Well, I suppose the darkness does match my soul. <laughs> Ow! The edge! <laughs> For this shadow of the hedgehog ass motherfucker. <sighs> After all, I'm what they call a night stalker. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sit the fuck down, man. Try not to cut somebody on your way out. <laughs> I'm kidding. Um, What are you talking about, Vale? I said I'm a night stalker. Deal with it. Only the chosen ones can wield the power of the darkness. That's how you know I'm a night stalker. Yeah, whatever, Batman. Only the light bearer can resist one such as me. You mean Mithra? Light and dark are in a constant struggle, a never ending war known as the Sacred Contest. We conserve our power and stand poised, each staring at each other with the coiled power of a hungry tiger. But one dawn, the dark shall surely be victorious. A new world of Night Stalker d domination will be re- What in the fuck? I'll wait patiently for the dawn of the Black Sun and Mithra, do you know what the fuck's going on? Not a word. I haven't heard anything like it, not even 500 years ago. Vale is definitely something special. She's fucking talking like an anime villain. Vale, relax my girl. It's not that serious. We're talking about girl power. She just said you look good at night and Vale just went off. The light bringer, my nigga? I think you in the wrong game, baby girl. Core Frisky, thank you for sending me fucking porn of Goku getting fucked in the ass by Gon from Hunter x Hunter. Talking about it tastes pretty good. You really wanna? You really think this is funny, bro? It's fine, man. Keep trying to get me fucked up. Keep trying to get me fucked up, nigga. And he deleted it, or maybe the post got deleted. I don't know. Ah, it's no good. I'm done. I'm all talked out. Or maybe there's some more. Turn this farce into a three act yeah. comedy. Okay. Oh, yeah, right. And so, thanks to the beautiful Mithra, the tale continued. The tale continues indeed. These motherfuckers haven't stopped talking. It's been morning. We're kind of in a bind here. Yeah, no kidding. Every bout so far ended in a draw. Who would have thunk it? At this rate, the sun will be up before we know who has the most girl power. Well, I'm sure the next person who comes by will be able to help us. Let's just agree to go with whatever that they say. Got it. Man, it, if I have to restart this quest and go back to the beginning and lose all this progress just to choose a different choice, man, uh, there's no way, bro. Fuck that, because you don't have opportunities to save in the middle. Nia. Good timing, girl. Uh, what is it? I don't know if I'm up for any more of your weird games. No, it's nothing strange. We just want you to tell us who has the most girl power, me or Korra. Girl to power? Wow, there's veil porn too. Etika, don't show this on stream. I won't show it on stream, but I will put it in this. <laughs> Damn, bro. As soon as we talked about veil, no motherfucker just pulled up some shit. Man, that's a save. Thank you, my friend. You're doing God's work out here. Shout out to Nintendo Johnny. I wouldn't show that even if we fucking told me to. Because it's fucking porn. It's, it's veil getting plopped. Um, Goku getting fucked in the ass. I never thought I would hear that. Yeah, man. Gone did it. Girl to power. You still haven't done with your stupid contest yet. <laughs> I, I, okay, you know what? I said I don't like imitating voices, but with Nia, it's just fun. Oh, how fucking heavy her accent is. Hey, come on. Just give us an answer. Don't hold back. Serve it as it comes. Out with it, Nia. It's me, right? I got the most girl power. No way. I've got more in my little finger. 
Well, you need to back that up with something, Mithra. All your girl power is in your fucking mouth. That's not a bad thing. That's what you think, right, Nia? No, that's not what you think at all, is it, Nia? Okay, I decided. Who is it? I decided not to take part in this blood. She ran the fuck away. Nia had to, she had the right idea. She wasn't even trying to fucking argue with him. She just fucking dipped. Nia. Damn. She just fucking vanished from the situation. It was like, whatever. All right, so what the hell's going on now? Hey, looks like the sun should be up before long. What time is it? Uh, it's seven o'clock. I guess the contest is over. Yeah, it's over, nigga. Oh, None of y'all so won. it is. But we don't really have a clear winner yet. Indeed. Cora. I'm starting to get the measure of you now. Oh yeah, they bonded a lot. Admit it, but you do have more girl power than me. Really? Well, that's really big of you, Mithra. Aww. You're my only rival when it comes to girl power. I salute you. So Cora is the queen. <laughs> the... <laughs> Damn. Uh, well, I'm pooped, but it was fun. Yeah, yeah, she got it though. She yeah, was. I think it was Cora too. I mean, I like Mythic, but I mean, damn. Oh God, not again! They stay up all night, nigga. Come on, no, we can't do this. Morag? Oh shit! The ladies came back. Uh, everyone. So, how come you're all gathered together? Well, now. Your little contest might be over, girls. But there's one more judgment to make. Uh-oh. It's about all your reckless gallivanting. Uh-oh. <clears throat> Time for a little court martial, I think. Are they about to hang both these chicks? Uh, uh well, uh... Hey, listen. Didn't we help you discover your inner girl power, too? Uh, yeah. A little bit, uh, I guess. That's true. It just seems like you pissed everyone off. No. No. Uh oh. Definitely no. Uh oh. I think you need punishing. A really? spanking? A spanking? Punishment doing what? You can't go around doing stuff like that. Sorry. They fucked up Praxis, man. They need to apologize to her. They process. fucked her up. I know, sorry. Make sure it sinks in. I we will. I'll punish Cora, someone said, oh. It's a promise. It's a promise. In that case, the epic <laughs> contest concludes without epic. Oh no. That means two losers and two forfeits. Uh oh, so they both gotta dance. Ah. Great idea, Morag. Huh? Oh no. Not so fast. Oh no. Something wrong. Mm. Uh. <sighs> Nothing. Y'all both fucked up. This music, what what the fuck? This is like Oh god, they're doing it! <laughs> what the fuck? Everyone's just sitting there watching. Even Taurus watching? What the fuck? What kind of dance is this? Nah, that's great. You know what? Yes. I'll take that. I'll take that. It's not it's not okay, they're not they're not giving lap dances, Why but that's good enough. Stuff keep happening to me. <laughs> She's fucking Mithra, pissed. Don't complain. You talk the talk, now dance the dance. Yeah, there we go. Shake that shit. Hit that shit, bro. What that shit called? What kind of shit is that? This is the pits. Is that a Dougie nigga? <laughs> <laughs> what? That was great. That was great. I mean, hey, I was hoping for a lap dance, but it's all good. Nothing wrong with a bit of late night banter, Cora, but there's no need to put others out. You don't want to have to sit through another one of Morag's lectures, do you? Yeah, I get it now, but sometimes it's fun to get caught in conversation, right? I hope we'll have a chance for a little tit a tet sometime soon. I'm game for that. I don't mind saying you're an absolute hoot. And with that, my friends, it seems like we are at the end of Korra's uh, affinity chart. Etika, man, you should join Team Tenso. Jake Paul 
can use you for clickbait with the title I freed an African star. <laughs> the build up for this. I like that. That whole that statement takes you on like a trip. Oh, join Team 10, Jake Paul, clickbait, me, YouTube, collab. I freed an African slave. Perfect build up, man. That's one of my favorite comments I've read all day. I like that. The contest ends with no clear winner. And wait, we never saw Rex pop in again, man. Rex just was completely ducked the shit out of it. How Tora was watching these girls break it down, but Rex was completely absent. The contest ends with no clear winner, and both contestants are forced to perform the forfeit by irate comrades. The voracious vanguard has returned! Aw, oh, shit, and returned that's the safely. end, man. Angelic drop level 5. I think we're done completely with you. Yep, that's it. It's it was like fun. A glimpse of the real me. Thank you for staying around. Uh, I hope you're not tired of me yet, or that we're not in some kind of rut. Oh, I miss the excitement of the early days. Anyway, that's to say, don't you dare replace me, yeah? Rather I, impressive. I fucking love Cora, man. That was really, really fun. Um, that's the end of all story stuff in regards to her. So you know, it's a little sad, but you know, it, it, it was a nice, it was a nice journey up until this point, man. Cora is completely done. Yay, nigga. Anything else? Hey, Poppy Buster. Fixing Poppy Buster now go smooth. Affirmative, mom. He called her mom? This nigga Poppy Buster's crazy. I thought that was like someone you served, not your fucking mommy. Erica, can you advertise my Minecraft server? I'll advertise you this block button. <laughs> I like Cora, but I don't understand this game. Yeah, it's kind of... It, it's complex. I'll, uh, I'll, I'm not going to lie with you on that one. Defeat a blade bot at the world tree. We could do that real quick, but I don't really care right now. This shit is done, bruh. Cora is definitely going to stay on the team, man. She's a real cool character. But now we have um this Merc mission with Harold, so let's see what's going on. Well, I'm great, aren't I? Well, of course man. you are, man. Bro, what kind of dance was that? I It was so weird. I mean, I thought, oh wait, I mean, y'all thought Susu was dead, shot in the head, but he's back to life with some Terminator shit, and he My comes back with a blonde lollipoppy. Right. Yeah, Professor Susu's re, um, resurrection, bro, that surprised the fuck out of me. It's funny, because there's other quests that, like, refer to him as being dead, and I did those after I got Poppy Buster, so they're like, oh, what about Susu? What do you remember of him? And they just saw him. He just gave them the Poppy Buster, and it's like, oh, shit. It's pretty funny. All right, I'm going to save the game again, because I'm paranoid. And um, let me see. Now we gotta go find Harold's ass. Nigga, are you not tired yet? I thought you got a semi-regular sleep schedule. Yeah, but you know that shit fucking it it it, it imbalances itself on a regular basis. You know what I'm saying? Like it, it gets fucked up every week. It, I can deal. I can force myself to sleep too. I take a five-hour energy when I want to stay up. Although that's not really good. I try not to, but I mean, if I can will it, then I do. But I mean, usually, I, I, well, not usually. I mean. Only if it gets to, like, the extreme. Then I take a five-hour. Or I'll take, like, a, a Z-Quill to, like, go to sleep early if I really wanted to. But, I mean, eh, it regulates eventually. Where is this quest? Where can we find Harold's ass? Flames of Justice. Um, there we go. Whoops. That was fun, though. It was a lot of talking, but it was fun. What game is this? I ain't know because I ain't got a Switch yet. I'm getting one next check in like four days. Bro, you're going to love this console, man. This game is called Xenoblade Chronicles 2. Um, if you want a big, one of the biggest, most deep and like content, like this, this has so much stuff to do, bro. Like I've been in this game 500 hours and I'm, you know, I'm not even done yet, man. If you really want to, bro, you can get immersed in this and have something to play for months and months and months. Head to Bone Road in Spirit Crucible. Okay. To Bone Road it is, man. That was really, really fun, though. Not as satisfying as I thought it would have been in terms of like Rex is being Rex being integrated, but it was still good. To the bone road. Mario Kart 8 Deluxe is also fun. Yeah, you know, that's a standard title. Everyone would fuck with you on that. Harold. Comrades. How'd you end up here? You led us on a merry dance, no mistake. Apologies. Okay, I'm not gonna read all this. You had the real that before. You seem back to your old self. Shall we move out? Alas, I can't. I want you to lead me to meet my fate. So you don't rampage? Correct. Yeah, man, that was our fault. We aren't going to let you stew in your own juices. Yeah, man. Harold, relax, man. You're thinking about this way too much, baby. Oh. Harold? You're right. Stop. Don't come near me. Oh, shit. Uh, 
See, here's the thing. We can't ignore a friend when we see them suffering. Mm-hmm. I like how they finish each other's sentence. Oh, shit. Huh? Excuse me? Hey, that body. You can't keep your power in check, can you? It's like, um, Electra. Just go. Run! What the fuck? Yo! Harold! It looks like our only option is to restrain her by force. We gotta beat her ass. Yeah. Hydreigon is still in confusion. Oh shit, this is the outrage right there, bro. Fuck, you're right. This is like some Hydreigon shit. Alright, we gotta beat Harold's ass. Looks like I won't even have Herald to Unbound? Justice. Whoa. Let's keep our heads in the game. Get her ass. Poppy will provide defense. Let me do Pull it. Back. Oh, we can do it. Hey, why I changed Pandora. Oh, oh, yeah. yeah. Shit, she ain't doing nothing. Well, I mean, we're rolling with power, so it doesn't really matter. Quick and hard. Let me do it. I've waited for this all day. This is the only time where you fight the blade herself, really? It seems like kind of rare to me. It seems very rare. Yeah, get him. Oh, Praxis. Let's go, baby girl. Stab that motherfucker. She's fucking mad, yeah, I know, right? Oh, I have my level three. I don't have why don't why am I not getting my level four though? Get back! Mm. I don't know I don't think we're gonna go through with the full KO though. Yay! We did it. Why is there so much talking? <laughs> <laughs> That's the number one question to ask for a fucking Xenoblade game. Harold, are you all right? Looks like we pulled the plug on Rampage mode. They beat the shit out of her. <laughs> they beat the fucking shit out of her. Smash my core crystal. It's it's the only way. You're making a big deal out of it. this situation. Seems under control, Harold. This is the only chance you'll get. Uh huh. Yeah. The burden of my sin is like, e like even though I'm over leveled and we ran through the battle like it was nothing. Even the fucking team members, it's not like they're like, oh my god, she's so strong in the cutscene, and it's like, ah, we can't take her, bro. How are we gonna calm her down? She's so powerful. No, they're like, all right, well, that's your ra that rampage. That <laughs> rampage. Okay, so we're good now. And Harold's like, ah, it's too strong. You have to stop me. You have to destroy me. And the guys are like. Why? <laughs> They're so relaxed. It's so Already mismatched. Too much to bear. Shut the hell up. You see what I mean? We'd never do something like that ever. Then I will run. Everyone's just like. Again. And next time, innocence will suffer. So we beat the shit out of you again. Anyone anymore? Shut the hell up. <laughs> if you really care about me, then please end it. Screw that! Whoa. I can't possibly agree to those terms either. Nia is so feisty, bro. I love it. Don't you remember what King Eulogimenos said? Eulogimenos, that's how you say you it? So that we would take care of you. Whether you go berserk or not, it doesn't change a thing. Listen to Rex. The days of worrying about yourself running out of control are over. We'll stop you as many times as it takes. Mm-hmm. So don't ever think that you're better off gone. You've already helped us so much. Now we get to help you in return. That's what friends are for, right? <laughs> friends. So, Harold, you get what we mean now? You and your little rampages, your little tantrums. We'll, so, we'll calm your ass now. It doesn't matter. You're saying you'd let me stay with you? 
Yes. This, this music is amazing. Thank you. I just got sent a bunch of fucking stuff on Twitter that's looking crazy. Damn, niggas. Hold on a second. I gotta save some of this shit. Yeah, that, 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 these are all saves, bro. I'm adding this one right now. <laughs> Fuck. Oh, yeah, I just downloaded the webpage by accident, man. That's how enthusiastic I was to fucking save this shit. Very fucking nice. I like it. <laughs> Thank you, guys. Thank you. Save that. Yep. You know, just do it real quick. Save that, too. Wow, that these pictures, man. Where the fuck y'all be finding this shit, bro? I don't know. There must be websites far better than like R34 and Gelboro and Downboro and shit, man. Like that, that, that that's crazy. And, I, and now there's one, there's a fucking Smash Brothers screen cap of Mewtwo, and it looks like he's putting Game Watch on his damn stomach. I thought that my existence as a weapon could cause nothing but pain. You're on the same shit that Mithra is. So what you told me, I'm gonna reconsider that. I'm gonna protect um, the power of my people. Yeah, man, strange. Yeah, the only thing that's strange is you thinking that it's strange, girl. Um, I should let you know that I'm 110 behind, uh, percent behind you on this as a driver. No, as a friend. Thank you. I, I feel like it's kind of meant for Zeke to be her driver. I'll do my best to live up to your expectations. Indeed. Pixiv? Really? It's all about Pixiv, bro? Alright, so we got her back. Welcome back to the squad, Harold. You and your little rampages. <laughs> that was so fucking... I thought it was going to be something way more intense than that, but that was kind of like basic. It's all good, though. Harold's released from her berserk state and moved to tears by kind words from her comrades. It's touching, but damn, I had crazy expectations. I thought story was going to be developed and shit like that, but no. Damn, that's all? I wish you would not. You made me realize my full potential. Thank you. Rather impressive. Okay. You know what? Whatever. I want to use my power to protect. I want to protect this world, not destroy it. I understand now. From this day, I live to protect you all. Indeed, Harold. I'll do my best to live up to... Okay, damn. I thought I was going to get more, man. More like explanation. More story. More like lore or something. But no, that's it. I think Harold's a really, really cool character. It's kind of a shame that they don't go any further. Like, her design is awesome, bro. Oh, well. Um, we, we got a lot of stuff in this game as is. What do you think of the story themes in the game? Oh, the, this game's story? Especially if you played the last Xenoblade? Oh, shit. Nigga, it's crazy. I mean, the voice acting at some parts, only in a, a few parts. When shit gets intense, sometimes it falls a little short. But, I mean, it's still very immersive. It's still really, really good, man. Harold's extremely broken if you raise her to S plus trust. Really? Is there a reason S plus specifically? All right. Well, we can continue now. Um, what other blades should we work on? Hey, Poppy Buster got level four, bro. Fuck yeah. Let me let me boost this nigga up. Poppy Buster online. Skill limiter removed. <laughs> Acknowledged. All right. Just more trust. Okay. It's a pain in the ass to get to S plus. Fuck. Oh well. And since I've been playing this for so long, man, it's like, it'll just happen naturally. I don't even give a fuck. Alright, so, who else? Who else? Who else? Who else should we work on here? Um, I don't know. Maybe it's time to go to sleep. It's a little bit... <laughs> Poppy said, yeah -ha! Remember the trailers for this game? That dub was shit. Yeah, you're right. Uh, is Nia have any story to do as her blade form? Defeat a crustal Sovereign. Okay, nope. This is all... Wow, okay. This is all... Okay, yeah. None of this is... Uh, maybe one of them story, but I can't see it. Who else? Who else? Pandoria? Maybe Pandoria. What else is left for her? At Genbu Port and Tantal, view the heart to heart. What's the what's in a name? Genbu Port and Tantal. Okay. Let's do that. Do I have her on the team? No, I do Let's not. Let's about the house situation first. All right. All right, Harold. So you know Joe ass down. We're done with you. How long is the uh, The homegirl. I don't know, but it's about. Where is she? Oh. Please be good to me. Oh, I will. And now, um, Tanso Genbu Port. Boom. It's a little late, so this might be the last thing I do. Might as well just get it out the way, right? Poppy's so awesome, I know, man. Alright, guys, after this, we're gonna wrap it up. It was a cool stream, though, man. Sponsors, thank y'all once again for coming through. Alright, so we're over here. Hey, 
Sandy. I just had a thought. I like the background. Oh no. <laughs> oh no, what do you mean? So quick to judge, you don't even know what I'm going to say. Well, you're not the most sophisticated of thinkers. I can read you like a book. She's always shitting on his hey, life. You can't talk to your driver like that. That's disrespect. Go on then. If I'm so easy to read, what am I thinking? You are that easy to read, and you just Aurora, you're out, bro. Take care, you. man. Uh <laughs> Bingo. You are so predictable. Go on then. Oh, what is Lord. it this time? I promise not to laugh. You can tell your big sis. Big sis? Come on, you know you want <laughs> Wait a sec. What makes you think it'll be something to laugh at? Listen. When I tell you my new title, you're going to be proper impressed. Okay, now I'm curious. Zeke von Genbu. Chaotic bringer of chaos. Ooh, chaotic. That has some extraness to it. Oi, I heard that. You can't deny the coolness of the name, surely. Zeke is fucking... He's getting bodied out here. Of course not. It's very cool. Suits you down to a T. Super cool. Super cool, my nigga. Felicify is like, yo, this is still going... <laughs> <laughs> yes, nigga. I, I I don't know. It just kind of kept rolling. I was like, whatever. You're not even pretending to be serious. Why don't you try again? <laughs> oh, Pyra? It's so funny watching you guys. Oh, hello, Pyra. You arrived at just the right time. We're getting nowhere with Pandora. Pyra, lend us your judgment. Okay. Who, me? Yes, you. What do you think? Zeke von Gembu, chaotic bringer of chaos. Fuck it. Fantastic Let's be nice. Right, obviously. Pyra's a sweetheart, man. You know she would say that. Wow, there's some. I'm, I'm being sent some images, bro. Okay, okay, hold on. That's a save. There's a lot of saves here, bro. That's quality. Thank you. Thank you so much. Wow. Oh uh, uh, man, if you guys saw my screen this now, it would be a fucking ban instantly. All right, some of the. Okay, some of these I have. All right, so I mean, yeah. Okay, there's not a bunch of new stuff out of my scope. No need to worry about hurting his feelings, Pyra. You can be honest. Why does the music sound so intense? That's just how it is, bro. Like, Xenoblade, man, they, they fucking, the soundtrack is ridiculous. I am being honest. I think it's a very creative name. Uh-huh. Huh? No way. You're kidding, right? Okay, so Pyra just became super oblivious at this point. Finally, somebody who actually understands. At least someone does. Go on, Pyra. You need a title as well. Oh shit. Huh? Me? The fucking blushy crushy maiden right there. Yes, something that really captures the spirit of who you are. What the fuck, man? People keep sending me porn, bro. <laughs> my fucking Twitter. You see my eyes? My eyes keep shifting to the fucking right. I'm like, mm. <laughs> oh yeah, story. Mm. <laughs> Steady on, my prince. Pyra doesn't want a stupid name. Okay. Lay it on me, Zeke. Give me that title. Okay, what are you gonna call her? Someone's gotten carried. The titty away. sword. The titty sword of fling. <laughs> right then. From now on, Pyra, you shall be Pyra von Aegis, omen of retribution. That's actually not too bad, bro. Pyra I would. Von that sounds like so. Omen of retribution. Okay. Uh, really, Pyra? If you don't like it, you should just said so. I fucking love it. I love it. <laughs> I knew she was gonna say that shit. I don't really know what it's supposed to mean, but it's so cool. It's so radical, what nigga. All rest is going on. These two are incorrigible. Yeah, man. You know, I couldn't beat up on Zeke. I had to. I'm tired of niggas shitting on my boy. He's my boy. So you know what? I flipped the table on it. Pandoria, you getting shelved, my girl. Sit the fuck down. Right. Just like I thought, Pyra gets me. Uh huh. Exactly. In fact, maybe you should just be my blade. Uh, I think I'm good, thanks. She hit him with the skirt, skirt. Like, no, nigga. Huh? Damn, she that killed him, Zeke. Easy, but drivers need to be a lot more than amusing. Yo. What? <laughs> You're going to need an ice art for that burn. That was worth the wait. It's gonna take him some time to recover. Damn! They killed Zeke! They killed him! She, she curled the... Ah, that is fucking foul! 
Pyro was like, yeah, I'm with it. Just when you think you are in, you got past the friend zone, you thinking that, oh yeah, you know, I put the moves in. Baby girl, she's hypnotized, bro. She's all about me. You make that move and she's like, no, nigga, I was being nice, okay? And it's like, yo, he got put on the sh He got, okay. Damn, I thought we were ganging up on Pandoria, but Zeke still wound up getting destroyed at the end, man. That's fucked. She, 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 she fucked him up. Damn. And Pandoria got the boost. All the hard work's paid off. I love how Pandoria's voice gets when she gets excited. It fucking starts to grind. Like, it's paid off? Like, what the fuck? Pyra really did a number on my prince there. He'll need some time to recover from that burn, and it is immortalized in her goddamn affinity chart. Hey, doesn't discovering all these amazing places make us amazing too? And defeat an Indoline Sentinel at the World Tree. All right, so this that, that's basically gonna be it. Indoline Sentinel. What does that monster look like? You know what? I feel, I feel like getting Pandoria is done real quick. Oh, it's that thing. Okay, fuck it. We can kill four of those. They're not um MVPs, are they? Fuck it. Let's go kill it real quick. I got a little bit more time. Hey, Etika, it's just like in Smash. Taunt to get bodied is a true combo. I know. I've seen that shit. That motherfucker hits 24-7, hits bro. She fucking took care of it. I know, man. Y'all see this shit? It's so fucked up. All right. Let me change up the party real quick. Um, let's make sure I have some, um, you know, some, some connectivity. You know what? Let's put, let's put fucking Morag back in on the tank position, man. I want to use the Poppy Buster. I love that thing. Even though I wish it was customizable. Put it in the first slot, man. I hope I won't disappoint. We have um, electric. We have earth. Um, Rex, Rex, you're gonna need a earth blade, my boy. A healer, preferably. Hey, Florin, <laughs> what Rex, are you doing? I'll do my best. Of course. Uh, we have wind, ice, electric, earth, water, fire, um, dark, light. Okay, so we are good here. We have all coverage. I think. Yeah, we're good. Okay. Killing those is a bit annoying since you gotta skip travel again. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah, because we, th there's only one of them that spawns, right? Shit, okay, well, you know what, whatever. I, I like the World Tree music anyway, so I'll deal. That's really good music. This is it, right? The Indoline Sentinel. So, wait, I'm confused. Can you equip each driver with three blades? Yeah, each driver has You've three blades. Way, so, eh? in total. The parties wind up being like three, six, nine people big. No, no, excuse me. Um, four people because you have the driver and then the blades, so you have four, twelve people battling consistently. I mean, it's not really twelve at one time, but I mean, you know, you can switch them in and out, so it's like twelve people are in the battle, yo. I like the way they integrated it, so you can just have a bunch of fucking characters at once. It's a really, it's real clever. All right, we gotta kill this thing. Fuck it. Let's do it real quick. Let's go then. It's not gonna take long. Stay true to your disciplines. Let me turn the volume down because the battle music gets real fucking loud, especially around this part. Let's do it real quick. Let's take care of this nigga. Two leaves. Get him, Vale. <laughs> Vale had me fucked up with that goddamn um, girl power shit. She started speaking crazy. Even Mithra was like 500 years. I never heard no shit like this, nigga. Fuck. Vale is crazy, bro. Alright, so now let's fast travel here again. The Indoline soldiers are so sh they have so little HP. They barely they're they're, they're they're the least threatening enemy in the game. Um, Indoline soldiers are so shit. I swear to God, Amalthus, your soldiers can eat. Wait, they eat shit for dinner for them to be so weak. He doesn't feed these motherfuckers, man. I didn't realize he treats his soldiers like shit too. Well, no, I wonder why he's dead. No, oh, it's boiler. <laughs> or maybe not. I don't know. Don't let them off easy just because they're weak. This music I'm is... Like this music, bro. The World Tree or the World Tower. Just come to find out, this ain't even a tree. It's a fucking tower. This game already mindfucked the fuck out of me. When as soon as you walk in and you see it's technology and it's like, wait a second, this isn't even a tree. And those are glyphs, not leaves. 
What the fuck? You can start Cosmos' quest on the world tree? Really? Get him, Poppy Buster! Yeah, just get him. Just get him. But I'm biased. Oh shit. The music is really, really good around this. Like, I mean, goddamn. Let's do it again. We need to do a different one. They said Poppy commands the Poppy MK2, right? Where the fuck is she? <laughs> You're about to see. Maybe I can do it this time. Maybe I can do it this time. As a matter of fact, you know what? Let's switch out somebody. Um, Zeke, let's just get Kazi in there. We already have water anyways, right? Get in there, Kazi. I'm literally an 18-year-old French dude, and I've been in Boston for this semester. I like this place, and I fucking love your streams. Please don't censor yourself because of PC culture. Not at all, man. I'm still. I'm always going to be doing me. MK is actually pronounced Mark. Uh, yeah, I, I, I think I kind of knew that, but I just pronounced MK out of habit. But yeah, I, 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 I'll, I'll try to remember the mark. Yeah, you know, I, I, I knew that technically, baby. Hey, you know, I'm just trying to save face a little bit. Don't let them off easy, just cause get them, Kazi. Do not underestimate them. Ready for get departure, back. master. Hey, I fucked that one up. Don't slack now. Push them back. Get them. Now it gets in heavy hitter. Yeah, just in time. Yeah. Oh shit. I'm just gonna like wait for my level 2 to get there. Get him, Cosmos! Heal everybody. Get him! Alright, so Poppy Buster. That's where the Poppy Mark II is, man. In the chest of that nigga. She's inside of his ass. Oh, he's dead already. Cosmos is too strong, man. I love how Poppy talks through her, so she's like, oh yeah, Poppy's ready to do business. <laughs> I was like, what the fuck? Wait, hold on, is Pandoria in the party? Hey, are you, did you get your shit already? Oh, one more, okay. Yeah, let's go, one more. Edgar doesn't know how to censor himself. <laughs> You're damn right, man. You know how many times I dropped the N-bomb while I was in, like, and the thing is, I do know how to speak properly whenever I'm in a social situation, so... I, I certainly can restrict myself, but every now and then when I get caught up or I'm excited about something, like the, the vernacular of the hood just leaks out, and out of nowhere, I just drop an N-bomb. I could be talking business with somebody at a table with a bunch of people in suits, and I can hold myself down, but when someone brings up like a video game I like or some sort of reference to the culture of my channel or whatever, I'm just like, oh, yes, of course, those niggas. I mean, I mean, I mean those, <laughs> those individuals. I, I love them. <laughs> it's like, what the? I've done that, but the great thing, because I work for myself and I do whatever the fuck I want, you, I, can, I don't even get in trouble for it. I can do whatever, I can say whatever I want, and people are like, oh, he's so great. <laughs> it's like, hey, man. That's one of the reasons why I do YouTube, man. Just the freedom of being able to, like, be me. Looks I can just like be I me. Even have to use the eye of shining justice. Do not Yo, we me. have inks, man. Thank you very much for coming through to the stream, my boy. Appreciate that. He says, here's a little something before I go to bed, my boy. Thank you for the amazing stream. I'm glad that you enjoyed it so much, dog. I didn't think it was shit, but I mean, hey, he's having fun, so fuck it. Thank you, guys. We had, like, 500 people this stream, man. It's cool. Sponsor streams are always real chill. Yeah, no. Thunder Doom! And now Pyra, get in there. I think this is gonna do like over 100. I think. No, oh, damn. oh, some more of them? Has he changed Pandy's courtship? Um, you mean her? Uh, oh yeah, 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 yeah. They all have, they all have gold chips. Everybody. Yeah, everyone's gold. This nigga Zeke's moves, bro, are so ridiculous. Thanks for being on healing duty. It helps a lot. I'm glad you think so. 
Sir Rex is easily fooled. Good to know. What the fuck, man? Florence scares me. Okay, let's see. I'm gonna save this again. I think I'm done. Remember when we back when we had this many people playing Fried Emblem on Twitch, bro? It's crazy to think back to those days. Back in those days, 500 people. What you know was considered like, like you said, this is like an all-time low right now, 485. But back in those days, that was like, whoa, we have 485 people in here. Yo, welcome to the stream, guys. I'm so excited. Like it would be, that would be like, whoa, wavy. It's crazy how things change over time. And with that, Penny's done. Using this. Thanks for bearing with me. No Rather problem. Impressive. I'm a look. I'm looking forward to this shit. All right, I, I've been looking forward to it. Fuck. If it's lightning you need, I'm your girl. And Pandoria is done. Who else? Is there anyone else that we can knock out of the way real easy? Is it just like, you know, um, is there anyone else like, you know, that was that was quick. That was painless. I love this music, man. World Tree music is so beautiful. Who else is there? But yeah, all my blades, Um, you see the snare sword, like the snare sword or the plunder thing. They all have gold because the gold chip is really, really good. I feel like that's like end game fucking um, chip and it raises the chance of everything dropping. You can't beat that. Should I do Dagas? Is that an easy one? Or does that take like effort? No, go to sleep, bitch. Is the music better than Persona though? I doubt it. I mean, I heard Persona's fucking soundtracks from the back in the day were really good. And now Persona fucking 5, I heard that. And that, that's got like some of the best music ever. Isn't that like a nomination for like the best soundtrack of 2017? It was like second place, right? And it lost to Nier. Both of those are games that I really got to play. I mean, trust me, guys. I know how important. They, those games have priority, but it's just I'm caught up. Eventually, I will, though. Um, who else has an easy, easy, peasy one? Rock! Pleased to meet ya. Are you almost done, Rock? Defeat an Indoline Star. Um, that's a monster that we're kind of nearby right now, Rock. We can do that. Let me see here. That's only Rex Rex, though, right? You know what, Rex? Fuck it. Let's switch around. I'm Rock. Always have been. Always will be. We're going to throw in uh, Persona 5 um, OST is godlike. Uh, usually when it comes to godlike soundtracks, I listen to them ahead of time. But I want my first experience with those songs to be when I'm actually playing them and they pop up in game. You know what I mean? Like, I'm going to be doing myself rock. a disservice. Pleased to meet you. All right. We got you, Rock. Etika, don't lie. You're never going to play either of those again. Eh, never say never, you know. Eventually they'll pop up. Those games are way too legendary for me to completely shelf them for the rest of my life. But then again, I don't know what the fuck I'm going to be doing tomorrow even. You know, shit just comes and goes with me. I have no plan or schedule besides getting my fucking credit and house in order. When it comes to what I play and stuff that, you know, I never thought I would pick up arms again. I picked it up. It's kind of crazy. Uh, okay, that's fine. We don't really need to. In the line star, where is it at? What is what? Let me see. I think that monster is up here, isn't it? It wouldn't be back there, though. Isn't one of them things here? If you didn't do Dagas' quest before, then you're fucked. His chart resets. It pissed me off so much. What do you mean? It. What do you mean? Dagas? If you didn't do Dagas' quest by the time you finish it, his affinity chart fucking resets. Oh, the whole thing resets? Oh, really? Fuck. Oh, I didn't know that. Well, I found of figured something was weird with him because his fucking chart was like... It was like, um... He only had like one field skill or whatever, and it wasn't even that good of a skill. The, the, the porn I'm being sent now, Jesus. Uh... Where's the Indoline Star? Where can we find that thing? I think that's it right there, right? Isn't that it right there? Let me pull it up. Indoline Star. Yeah, this nigga. The World Tree 7 Perimeter. Center floor, seven perimeter skyport. That's where I'm at right now, right? Yeah, I just gotta keep moving. The whole fucking... Can you jump over? Okay, here we go, we found one. I'm not close enough yet. Let's 
show him a thing or three. Let's give him a piece of our minds. Gotta kill four of these fuckers. And I'm spamming. Hit. Here we go. We got it. All right. Rock. I can't reach him though. Or can I? Come and get it. I'm not down yet. Do I have an Earth? Oh, he's done. Does it count if I? Oh, he, does it count if I fucking? Okay, I can't walk away. Bye bye. <laughs> Reminds me of Don't Forget Me. Yeah, they. I think. I think they kind of had the same concept. They're like foot soldiers. You know what I mean? This get so loud when you're in battle. Oh my god. The fucking nigga fell. You saw him just. Come a long way, Rex. Azurda has raised you well. Rex has always had the makings. I just pushed him a little. Can I kill that one? Wilfred, bring out that brutal lance, my boy. It, it sounds, sounds fun. fun. Or, no, 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 no. We need a water too. Um, let me see here. Yeah. Bring out the praxis. Fuck I've it. waited for this. Don't forget it to me. Oh, here we go. We got another one. Damn, the nigga flies in with him. Came in like a wrecking ball, bro. Relax. Can we kill that? Then? Can we kill that one though? We can't even kill it. Oh no, it's part of it. The niggas work together, bro. Well, fuck you watch then. Yourself, Rex. Just watch this. Quietly. Quietly. Yo, Green, you dipping, bro? It was cool, man. Thanks for coming through. My fucking nigga. I fucking love Wolfric. Rock. Green, take care, man. You can get him, Rock. Sleep tight, nigga. Hey, we got it. Any other one out here that we can take out? Another one. I see it right there, bro. Can we go for it? Damn, I guess we can't. I guess I gotta fast travel back here. Oh, another one. Here we go. Boom. Oh, no, we can't target it. Fuck. Okay. I gotta come back. Now let me just get my thing so I can just kill him fast. Well, where to now? Is that one that we can kill? Oh, no, no. Yo, it's 5.30 in New York? Yeah, man, it's late night. This is probably going to be one of the last things I do on here, because, I mean, I'm not trying to stay up all night. Just watch this. This needs a lighter touch. Mithra, you finally got something right. Prepare yourself. Yay. Well done. Well done. Decimator. My, my I think this needs shine. a lighter Just give me the armor. I should be well. Work with them. Ha. Ha. Ringer of chaos. Finishing the yeah. 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 Let me take my guy. I am special inquisitor. Why was weird? It ended early. I'll be ready. It ended early. I've never seen that before. To be honest, the night is over. It's early morning. Yeah, I know, right? Your boy's been here for a minute. You can hear the setting sounds Poppy Buster makes.
try to throw this rock at it real quick. Come on. Come on. There we go. It's 2.30, bro. And on the west coast, that is. Let's show them a thing or three. Stay true to your disciplines. Yeah. Yes. Ha. Mithra. I should be able to make right on that. I really don't want to accidentally fall off this shit. Anchor shot. Ha. Thunder Cyclone. Hit it. Zip it. It's time to shine. Yeah, this is real nigga hours right now. It's late night, bro. You know it's late when a nigga stop talking this frequent, bro. When you just like chilling, you're just like, hmm, yeah. Uh oh. I was worried about that. I'm not trying to fall off. Oh, we got one of the fucking artificial ones. It's Saturday. Oh yeah, yeah, Saturday. You know, I'm just gonna fast travel back here. Cause yeah, I don't feel like walking all the way to the other one. Let's go. Wait a minute, am I killing the right thing or am I walling? Oh, I'm I'm tired. You know I'm tired, bro. I'm not even killing the right fucking enemy. My nigga Rock needs the fucking uh He needs the fucking um star, not the fucking sentinel. Whoops. What would you be doing for a living if this YouTube stuff didn't kick off? Um, I probably would have done something in like um like video editing or whatever. I really like editing a lot, so I probably would have been like an editor professionally or something. I know how to speak really well too, so maybe something like a. Uh, uh, I don't know. I can definitely see myself still doing entertainment if it wasn't for YouTube. I mean, if it wasn't YouTube, I got like a lot of other assets I feel like I'd be able to utilize. So, yeah, anything really. Um, I was in school for like nursing at one point, but I mean that didn't really. I, I, well, it wasn't really because I wanted to do it. It was just because hey, my mom was like, "Oh, you need to make money when you first get out of school." And I was like, "Yeah, whatever, nursing." But a rapper, <laughs> I guess. Thank God YouTube did work out. Get him. A nurse etiquette? That sounds like a bad timeline. That's the worst timeline right there. She ain't even stabbing nothing. Should we take a break after this? Yeah, we did it. My advance cannot be stopped. Such is the destiny of those who bear the eye of shining justice. Indeed. I'm in school for engineering right now. Yo, rock is done, bro. Congratulations, bro. My nigga rock. The power of wind, indeed, bro. And theory this should shit. serve to greatly weaken foes. The Eye of Shining Justice is extremely broken in New Game Plus. They change it? I know Zeke's level 4 when he's with Pandoria, he like fucking holds the eye, but he never like pulls the patch off. Does he actually remove the patch in New Game Plus and he's just like, you know what, fuck it? I don't know. I'm actually trying to get into college for video editing. You don't need to go to college to do that, man. Learn the shit at home through tutorials online. Um, whether you gotta pay for some tutorials or not, YouTube teaches you everything you need to know. Then put together a little portfolio of stuff that you edited and send that to companies, bro. They'll hire you on the fucking spot. Um, I used to do filming gigs and editing gigs because, you know, as a YouTuber, you have a bunch of fucking equipment and you have editing skills back in the day. Before YouTube started to pay me, man, I would do little gigs here and there and, you know, make a little. 300 200 dollars um filming some random shit i would do like a workout gig where you want to film me work him working out and you know a video where he looks like diesel but i did some video like that man i made like 150 off of that shit bro this work man this youtube shit bro it, it, there's a lot of other sub stuff that you can do if youtube ever goes down there's plenty that i can deviate into and i'll have the equipment for it cameras um sound equipment everything bro I want to be like you, bro, you know, just be self, just make sure that you can do whatever the hell you're doing by yourself, you know, you don't want to have to rely on some fucking nigga 
who doesn't have the same ambition to get shit done, you know what I mean? Defeat a Crystal Sovereign. What the fuck is a Crystal Sovereign? Is that the rusty nigga? Or the clean nigga? Crystal Sovereign. That is the... Oh, that's, no, no, that's the fucking, that's the, that, that's the T-shaped nigga. Okay, fuck it. Where is this dude at? He's in uh, the World Tree. Where are you at? Regular enemy, World Tree. Okay, just go anywhere. Yeah, I'm getting tired too, guys. I might be wrapping it up soon. But you know, I, I, since I'm here, I figured I might as well just get it done with. Since we're already in this fucking tree as it is, man. Or the World Tower. The tree. <laughs> yeah, real, real nice tree. I have never seen a tree look like this. Um, We're just going to go straight to this shit, bro. The Mizar elevator, whatever. Let's see what happens. Maybe I'll find one of these things. Well, Etika, you know, don't you technically rely on us with you doing YouTube shit as a job? Roger Wilco. Um, it's not that I rely on you guys. It's just that because I'm good at what I do, you guys watch me. If I wasn't good, then I wouldn't be making any money. And I wouldn't be able to do it as a job. I mean, you gotta remember that at the, at the first and foremost. Come out, come out. Let me see here. What else? But I mean, it's not like I'm good because I want to fucking make my... I mean, there's something that Nish naturally was good at, I guess. I don't know, man. Like, I feel like if you're, like, entertaining people, then there's a different kind of perspective you got to take on shit in a way. You know what I'm saying? You rely on me? No, you guys don't rely on me. I mean, it's just, it just, it's just happenstance that we, um, that we benefit from each other's existence. You know what I'm saying? We, we, we both we both perk from it. We've arrived. Am I in the same area? Roger Wilco. I had <laughs> Poppy Buster, man. Come out, come out. Um, I'm so sad. I definitely rely on you for my channel. I mean, in a way, but not really. Because um, oh shit, there's a chest here that I never got. Like. Saying that you rely on me in a way, like if I wasn't around, right? Let's just say my channel goes down and I'm not able to post streams or you're not able to get highlights from me again, right? All you're gonna do is move on to the next one and find entertaining content to highlight and clip and make funny memes out of from them. You know what I'm saying? You don't technically rely on me. You don't need me. It's beneficial to have me, right? But it's not a necessity. It's an inconvenience, maybe, to like change over, but still, that's not a necessity. Need is like you're dead if nothing, if that thing isn't around. You know what I'm saying? You're all mine. Antonio one two three 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 seven. Thank you, man. Watching an etiquette stream is like finding a penny on the street. It doesn't happen often, but when it does, you feel good. <laughs> a penny? <laughs> Who would pick up a penny off the street? For entertainment, specific entertainment, a collaboration more than rely. Yeah, yeah, it's more like a collaboration. People will use strong language there, but it's not the case. Okay, we found one of these things. The Crystal okay. Servant. What a disgusting ass name is that? You gotta kill you, bro. They talk so much in this fucking game. I wouldn't pick up a fucking penny off the street. What kind of what kind of life are you living? I don't mean to make fun of you. Neither spring. Alright, we're done here. We don't need to focus on these guys. These are little ones. How are you still alive, dude? I was born in the darkness, molded by it. <laughs> this shit is natural for me. Poppy Buster, bro. Best blade in the game. You don't pick up free money? I'll pick up a quarter. A penny? <laughs> I mean, I mean, you know what? Money is money at the end of the day, man. Let me not judge. I'm not going to judge. Change is kind of like, you know, I only... Quarters, nickels, dimes. Yeah. yeah. Roger Wilco. Roger Wilco. Uh, did we get them all? Is there any more for us to get? Yeah. I feel you, though, man. Those pennies, man. Enough of them shits and you get a dollar, bro. I feel you. Sometimes it be like that, bro. Let me not even judge, man. <laughs> back, back in 2012, man. If I seen that, yeah, I would have, I would have taken it, bro. I would have saved that shit up. Ten of those, and I'm able to get a sour power from the damn corner store. You know what I'm saying? And back in 12, man. Yeah, bro. <laughs> that sour power. That would be, that would be an in-between meal, my nigga. 
I've once found 40 bucks on the sidewalk. This channel is at least a 10. Oh, that means a lot. Thank you. <laughs> that means a lot. Oh, man. That came straight from the heart. I know my nigga was being serious. Where's the fucking Sovereign? Aren't you supposed to be here, my boy? Oh, does it walk down the damn stairs? I love how YouTube has sponsor icons. Yeah, man. Fuck Twitch. I don't know how the U.S. dollar system works. My bad. Nah, that's all good, man. All Us Americans, we, we aren't the epicenter of the universe, you know what I mean? You Fuck you. Bitch it, no! I wish I had some euros. Yeah, man. Oh, he's dead already. <laughs> Easy peasy. Done and dusted. Next. Is there another one? A 10. I wouldn't go that far. Hold on, Alyssa TV. Hold on a second. Is that homegirl Alyssa from fucking Boston right there? Yeah, I recognize that pretty ass profile picture. What's going on, Alyssa? How you been, girl? Your boy's chilling. I'm doing some fucking... This is some fucking weeaboo Xenoblade shit. But then again, you're all about that life. So, you know, you should feel right the fuck home, man. Well, everybody welcome Alyssa. That's my homegirl, man. Thanks for hitting the spawns button. I appreciate that shit. I'm, I'm like, tired, man. Like, I'm fucking... I've been streaming all fucking night, man. Just fucking had a huge fiasco last month, bro. Trying to get this house secured. Ugh. But your boy's feeling better now, though. Once again, from earlier today, guys, thanks a lot for um, making me feel better and shit, you know? Just trying to get this last quest thing done. Dude, I, how did I... Did I not... You're I don't think I explored mind. this fucking area. When I did it, I kind of just ran through. Um, hey, man, what's going on, guys? Yeah, man, give us some love, bro. That's a homegirl right there. Oh, there's a boss up here! You lost the upper hand. Mark fucking five... No, excuse me, Mark six? Let's avoid this nigga. Um, fuck you. You know, should we just kill it real quick? Yeah. Fuck it, let's kill it real quick. Let's just get it out of the way. You need, yeah, I didn't even realize this motherfucker was here. I definitely, I haven't even explored this tree yet, bro. This tower yet. Let's do it real quick. I'm not even playing on point, man. Like, I'm fucking playing sloppy right now. Hit him with a gamma ray, man. Fuck it. Is he done after this? Since I donate from Australia, donating 10 bucks to you equals 13 bucks Australian dollars thanks to the conversion rate. I thought our currencies were equal, bro. I thought they were equal, my nigga. We are so overpowered. <laughs> this shit is so easy. It's so fucking easy. Oh, wait, never mind. I'm talking too early, bro. Never mind. <laughs> Fuck. I don't even have a good fucking party format right now. Like, my party is so mixed up. We don't even have a healer. Etika, I need to go to sleep. Also, Etika kills a unique monster. I didn't even fucking... <laughs> I didn't even realize. I might as well have done it. It was quick. This fucking music, though, man. Okay, we found another one of these things. Let's kill it real quick. Leave it to me. There we go. Uh, I need healing. Attica's gonna uh, need to nurse himself after this sleep deprivation. Listen, I'm so used to this lifestyle, bro. It's nothing new. It's not out of the way for me, man. It, it, it's pretty standard. Fuck it, bro. Like, y'all talking as if y'all haven't had sleepless nights come either, on, man. Like, don't treat this shit as if it's brand new around here. Bro, I've been fucking staying up late night since I've been 16, man. This is this is life. This is I haven't chosen this life. It chose me. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Uh, the amounts of dots on the sponsor icon represent how many months you sponsor for. You get a star for every year. Yeah, I, I don't know. I, I kind of figured I would want to make like some kind of elitist bullshit where niggas fight each other. We already have the plebs fighting each other and the sponsors, and now we got the sponsors fighting each other over ranking and shit. Ariel though, Amber, motherfucking, that, that's MVP. She she got two black stars on her. I shit that, that the baby girl. She's been a fucking soldier in this stream, man. Thanks to God, Ariel. I appreciate that shit. 
Ariel's been fucking with me since like what, 2015? You found me off a of Pokemon shit. Nigga, sleep deprivation is weak. I'm sleeping two hours on the days I gotta be working eight plus hour shifts. Coke dealer, you, you're 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 about that life, nigga. <laughs> like, bro, the thing is, y'all dudes are doing the sleep deprivation shit, and I'm not doing saying this to brag, but I'm just saying I have it a little easier because you know I don't have to necessarily wake up in the morning for like a job or whatever. Well, you know I do. Um, every now and then to like get my own shit done, but I don't have to like get somewhere at a certain time You know what I'm saying? So I can like sleep in if I really wanted to um, It wouldn't be a productive day, but I could you motherfuckers out there y'all y'all the ones that get respect cuz you haven't been in a I can't imagine my life at this point Well, I can imagine working a nine-to-five, but I can imagine it being difficult considering how I'm so used to my own patterns at this point you dudes Y'all motherfuckers deserve medals, man. There's motherfuckers that I drank with that went out partying with me and it was like 5 a.m. And dude was like, I gotta be at work at 8 a.m. You wanna finish one more shot before before I leave? And I'm like, bro, you're a monster. How could you do this? And he goes to work and he sent me a picture. He's like, I'm on the job right now. My dude Benny, he's a paramedic. He saves people's lives and Two hours before, three hours before he was working, he was taking a shot with me. I know some savages, man. I feel like Alyssa's one of them, too. I don't know. When the time comes, bro, I'm going to have to call out every single one of you motherfuckers in here and see how real it is when you start to party, man. I've heard motherfuckers talking about Etika, man. I can get it in with you, bro. I'm about that life. I like to turn up and shit. And then I've met a couple of them at parties and events, two shots in, and they're like, oh, I'm done. I'm tired, man. <laughs> Fuck, man. I'm too late. And it's like, bro, the party's just getting started, nigga. Come on, man. That's why whenever, that's when I did my, my meetup in New York, I told everybody, I was like, listen. Don't come to the party if you're going to be on some bitch nigga shit, all right? Only come through. Only show up if you're going to turn up, man. I mean that shit. I mean, I, I guess a lot of you must think that this shit is done for fun. Oh, this is a game. Etika's just having fun out here. You know, he's fucking talking about all this getting lit shit just because he's trying to attract people. He's a content creator and entertainer. Okay, keep thinking that. <laughs> keep thinking it. <laughs> okay, when I see you at a party, bro, I'll catch that ass slipping. You'll be like, this motherfucker's a psychopath. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? <laughs> Fuck it. Uh, I got like 750 every two weeks on average. That's not bad, actually. That's pretty good income. I gotta find one of these um, fucking crusty sovereigns or whatever, man. Where, where's the fucking... Where's this shit at? That's that fast travel. He dropped a stitch in someone. I did. Oh, at a fucking real party. And dead ass, cuz I've had to go to work. With two to three hours after I was drinking heavy as fuck. That is respect out there. Um, two bottles a night. Heavy, no blackout, bro. No blackout after two bottles, bro? What are you made out of? Vibranium, my nigga? That's why I wish I could have been at one of your parties. Well, don't you worry, my friend. I'm throwing a huge party at EVO um, 2018. They're still doing a regular one for um, Vegas. So I have a huge party plan for that. Um, I'm going to be doing a... Uh, uh, just a mansion party standard and then for twitchcon i'm getting a charter i'm gonna get like a 30 person charter and you're gonna rent that bitch for like three days gonna be on the ocean no one to complain about noise or whatever 30 Time people a bunch of liquor go. food nigga the turn up is gonna be uh, i'm gonna be in my, my i'm gonna be in a fucking a fucking yeah. swimsuit the whole time <laughs> that, that sounds fun as fuck i can't wait get him TwitchCon's in my city? Oh, bro, then listen, I'm gonna be in the city then. You ain't gonna be ready for me. There we go. We got theory shit done. Um, there's a lot of other uh, stuff. There's a lot of other things to do in this tower. Um, Pyra needs uh, a Vate's house. That's the, the bird, right? Let me see. What about theory? Your shit Use done, theory? Power whenever necessary if i ever live stream in the future i'm stealing etika's layout it uses space better than any other layout i've seen this shit is a fucking mess you know how long it took me to craft this it, it looks simple but i mean bro i remember some times when i would like stream and it would be like set up to where the camera is too turned to one direction so you just see my face cut off like this <laughs> and it's like oh i'm enjoying the game like nigga fuck this, it looks simple it's trial and error man thanks a lot for that compliment though so I, I feel like honestly having everything transparent man like it, it it makes the best of space you know i like having a big fucking face cam because i'm a whore you know what i mean <laughs> so I, look at me fuck the content look at me nigga look at me well fuck on me you know what i'm saying uh let me see Alyssa says it'll be 50 60 in october here wait 50 60 in um in san fran 
Bro, that's fucking cold. Never mind. I ain't doing no charter. <laughs> We're going to be freezing on that boat. I ain't going to be in a damn swimsuit. I'm going to be in a coffin, man. Die from hypo hypothermia or some shit, man. Fuck that. Um, all right. Let me see. I got to... You know what? Let's just get one more character done, man. I mean, we're here in the tree. Might as well. I think this nigga... This nigga... Ajion needs something from here, too, right? You need... No, no. You need to raise affinity. Okay. That's all, really? You know what? Ajion, man. We need to throw you in the party and just get your shit done. Morag, can you can you deal with this nigga? Let's get Finch's bitch ass out of here. Hello there we go. There. Now we um let's find someone who can actually benefit from this. I think uh Vale could do something here. But I don't know. What about you, Nia? Showtime. A oh, crust all sovereign. Oh, okay, you benefit from that thing too? Oh, there's a lot of world tree monsters out here that boost people's um, affinity charts. Okay, so we got to throw Nia in. Um, I don't really want to use her though, cause she's like a healer. I mean, I, I mean, I can manage, but we'll just throw the Zekinator back in the first spot. Yeah, let's just switch it up, Zekinator. Okay. And now, um, I feel good with this blade setup. Let's just find another. Hey, hey, look at speak of the fucking devil, and he will appear. Where I've been looking for your ass. Get him. 500 hours and I still ain't beat the game, man. I know. I'm a, I'm slow as fuck when it comes to like beating JRPGs. And he's done. And Nia's done. There we go. Well, at least not like everything, but some things. Nia. <laughs> that was fast. Impressed yet? How about now? Of course. I was impressed as soon as you fucking revealed that outfit. <laughs> I'm being real, man. I can't I can't lie. I cannot tell a lie. Alright, so we're done with this. Who else is in the party that we need to get some level up here at? Is Morag? Oh, excuse me. Um Bridget done? You to view the heart to heart. A spirit Lexos at the world tree. What the fuck is a spirit Lexos, my boy? I can't wait for his reaction to the ending of the game, man. There's a lot of people that told me that shit gets crazy. I mean, but knowing how Xenoblade is, I mean, these things are, you can fight them at the damn tree. The seventh perimeter skyport is where we can kill these things. Mainly guys here, though. Yeah, there's a lot of fucking sausage. I think I have this game, but I never opened it. Alyssa, don't, don't. It, it, it's going to consume you if you're into JRPGs, man. Like, I got 555 fucking hours on this shit, and I have not finished it. it it's a problem. Um, the people here are also ver vulgar a lot. Ariel, you're, you're trying to fucking scare away all the fucking new people in here. Let's just, just, just have a good time, all right? This is one relaxed moment, Ariel. Don't ruin my shit. <laughs> uh, who was I going to... Oh, yeah, Bridget. Well, you know what? Just for trolling purposes, I'm going to throw Bridget on Rex because fuck it. Actually, no, no. I'm not going to be real. All right. I will do my best to prove my worth. And now we need to go to the seven perimeter Skyport. And kill one more of these things, or I think no, we have to kill a bunch. The middle level. Back to this fucking thing again. Mainly guys on the internet. No, I'm not. I'm innocent. Gee, yeah, that's fine. Where are we at? Can I reach that thing? I gotta kill that fucking long sausage, hot dog looking ass with wings. Can I reach that thing? Spirit Lexos. I need something with an ether cannon. Do not underestimate them. You know what? We might just bring Harold back in. Or Cosmos, why not? Ready for Do I have the master. distance thing on you, Kazi? I think so. Yeah, I think I do, okay. You know what? Yeah, let's shoot this bitch. Let's go then. Got him. Show us what you've got, Ozzy Clatter's Tanto. Etika gets around the same yeah, viewership yeah, as Dr. Disrespect or Soda Poppin' and somehow gets way higher donations. He knows how to cook someone in. But you know, but yeah, I mean, you know, yeah, nigga. <laughs> you listen, young nigga, young nigga, young nigga, young nigga, young nigga. <laughs> what can I say? I'm not even that young. I'm 28 years old almost. My birthday's in 10 days, nigga. Oh, no, it's in, wait a minute. It's um May 5th. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Oh, shit, motherfucking, my birthday's in a week. I have seven days until I turn 28 years old. <sighs> I'm, it's not really much to celebrate, man. I'm not really doing 
much for my birthday this year. But you know what? I, I thought I was gonna be in my nice big ass Brooklyn house or whatever. More, more, more stipulation. I got. I saw a lawyer and shit. I'm thinking about I'm about suing somebody, man. All that bullshit, man. Tenant blacklist off my it's bullshit. But I mean, hey, whatever. You have my Let's kill this bitch. I still have to play Final Fantasy. I'm still. It's still in the steel case. You mean 15? I played. I didn't beat 15, but I mean, I need to play that game too. Honestly, hey, it's such a good game. But I've been lacking, man. There's so many games, man. Fuck. Get him, Mithra. Damn, everybody's getting fucking points off of this. I have to fucking play um, Final Fantasy 15. I gotta beat that finally. Um, Persona 5 and Near Autonoma. Those are like the priority games. At some point, if I'm able to ever fire up my PS4, I mean, my, PS uh, my PS4 is fine, but it's just the Switch is so convenient, man. But if I'm ever able to turn this thing on and just to chill with it, those three games are priority, man. But they're all time sinks, except for maybe Near. It's more like action based, right? Alright, was did that count? Yes it did. We gotta do that three more times. Can I kill you know what? Fucking you are you're, you're here too. Don't we need to kill you? All these monsters need to get fucked up. There we go. Oh, that was it. <laughs> that was quick as fuck. And that counted, right? to Pyra. Are you good, baby girl? Yeah, she's good. All right. Let's just fast travel again, I guess. I really don't want to waste time looking around to see if they'll pop up again. So, let's take the easy route. Um, I forgot to get Donkey Kong today. Everyone keeps telling me about this tropical freeze, man. They they swear that it's one of the best um platformers ever. I might just try it out. I've never played Donkey Kong before, man. Just for Roger's base, I, I'll do him a favor. I want to be in on the memes and shit. I know they have that fucking theme song that do 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 do. <laughs> fucking shit sounds so crazy. Get him, Kazi. Burning breath. I know how that feels. That's after <laughs> I'll get that burning breath after I eat that halal, my nigga. <laughs> you know what I'm talking about? Get him. Get him, um, Poppy Buster. Motherfucking chest open up. Nigga, no lie. Donkey Kong games are some. Hey, Morak, did you see me? That was a cool move, yeah? It was a fine display of swordsmanship. Where's the other one? I gotta wait for him to fly around here. Where is he? Oh, here he is! Fuck! Right on time. The glory, hey? I'll handle it. Get back! Bullseye! Hmm. And again, Desi Desmond, Lyra, what's going on, man? You been good? We're almost done, guys. We're almost done. I know the stream's been lasting a minute. I'm tired too. I'm about to knock out. But. At least this will be done. I probably will. I'm probably gonna play a little bit more off camera, and then I'll like really wrap it up, man. Damn, bro! Someone's just spamming porn of the characters in my damn feed. Thank you. This dude's doing God's work right now. It seems. we're approaching our daily runtime limit. Looks like I won't even have to use the Eye of Shining Justice. Let's keep. Always gotta stay up and support your boy. Thanks, man. I swear to God, y'all motherfuckers are psychopaths. Like, let me get this done real quick. Fuck you. And you know what? Fuck you too. Oh, we gotta kill that thing. I'm, I'm paying attention to the wrong nigga. Alright, come here, bitch. You know what, Pandy? Let's do 
There we go. Nigga, don't act like the stream. Wait. Nigga, don't act like most of the stream that's here wouldn't keep on. Like, fuck. Yeah, you're right. I know. Y'all have always been about that business. I know. Damn, Wolf. What? Oh, he fucked my shit up. Oh, he fucked my shit up. Bruh, someone revive me, bro. How'd I get caught slacking like that? Thank you. Get him, man. Get back at this nigga. I can't believe he killed me. I wasn't really paying attention, though. You know? That's my excuse. Alright, now fuck him. Is that it? These voice lines are actual cancer. Eh? The general voice acting, in my opinion, is good. It's just in certain emotional tense moments. That's when it doesn't really hold up. But I mean, it's, it's still really passable, man. That's why I like it a lot. The accents, bro? Can't beat it. Fucking Scottish accents inside of a, of a, of a, a Japanese-based RPG. It's perfect. That was actually um, Welsh. All right. Here we go. This is the last time, I think. At least we're killing two birds with one stone, though. Legit. Like, like, literally. They have full conversations during battle. Now, that's skill. They like, they like fucking... <laughs> they, they, I remember when Xenoblade 1 first came out. I didn't play it when it dropped. But, I mean, it was like... People were like, why are they talking so much? <laughs> it's just... And they kept that theme. And they made it worse, in a way. I mean, like, they made it more intense, at least. The only good voice actor is Zeke and Malos. They're, they're definitely passionate voice actors. I like Malos just because he goes from level 1 to 100 in like 2 seconds. Like, Malos would be like, yeah, man, we need to find a way to kill that bastard. It's like, what the fuck, man? Chill. <laughs> Dude gets fucking, he gets fucking passionate. Uh, Alright, guys, uh, I think I'm about to close it up. Well, actually, no, no, we're not done yet. Did I finish one? I think Morag and Bridget are done. Thank you. I can't lose to Pyra. Really? Really? That's her motivation? My flame burns just as bright as Pyra's. Okay. Keep thinking that. The music in this game is definitely a A-OK. -okay. Indeed, bro. Music is like one of Xenoblade's strong points, I feel. And plot. Because it's like this game, what I love about it, Xenoblade Chronicles, by the time you get to the end, the story takes such a huge fucking turn that you never predict. I mean, I don't want to go too crazy in spoilers for the first game, but, like, you all know how Xenoblade 1 ended, right? Shulk, Monado Boy, and all that. When you find out who Shulk is and what the Monado is, and, like, it, it, it just changes everything. It's like, I have not seen Shulk the same way. Especially when you find out that he's, you know, fuck. It just, like, blew my mind in a way. And after that, it's like that plot twist. I mean, I know you guys have probably played a lot of crazy RPGs in your time. But Xenoblade Chronicles 1, in my book, holds the title for the craziest, most outrageous, insane plot twist I've ever experienced in a JRPG. Um, and maybe the plot twist itself isn't what makes it so crazy, but just how quick the plot twist happens. Like, you go from thinking everything's cool, hunky-dory, you're beating the bad guy. Yes, you're the hero. You save the world. And then... Damn! It flipped. It doesn't just flip the world upside down. Your world has transported to a fucking next dimension, and now you are an apple, my nigga. And you're an apple, like that's like floating in fucking nebula. Like, it doesn't make any sense. But I mean, it's so crazy. The extreme nature of it. So how the fuck is this place, this game, which is the sequel to the game that started that crazy shit? How the fuck is this gonna end? Something tells me this world that we're looking at, bro. This shit's falling apart, bro, and it's never gonna be the same after we beat this shit. You got shot with the I'll kill you thing? Yeah, man. Classic line. Classic fucking line. Alright, and Pyra's finally done. Thank God. When you finish this, you're going to fade into dust. Spoiler. <laughs> Indeed, man. God, I wish I could talk about Infinity War, but I just want to wait a few more days. 
Once everyone's seen that shit, then I'm I'm going all out, man. I'm, I'm gonna have the spoiler mouth. I don't even care. Fixing copy buster now go smooth. Affirmative, mom. Okay. The poppy buster is so cocky. Powerful. That was a difficult enemy, but I was able to beat it thanks to you. Now you got that baby girl all by yourself. Alright. Now I think I'm finally fucking done. I'm tired. I'm ready to rest. It is 6 a.m. right now. I'm fucked up. I watched it three times. Once in theaters, two times in shit cam quality. It's a great movie. Um, I think... Infinity War is the best superhero movie ever made. And, you know, this is coming off of Black Panther, which I thought was the best superhero movie ever made. I, well, maybe not. I love Black Panther. But, I mean, goddamn. Infinity War, bro. The action and the build-up, it's insane. Almost three hours long. And they say that the second movie is going to be even crazier, even longer, even more inclusions. I don't know how they're going to outdo themselves, but they probably will, man. Uh, anyways, guys, I'm out of here. I'm ready to rest. It was really, really cool. As usual, all the boys, all the niggas, all the people in there, man, thank you for making the stream very entertaining. I had fun. Black Panther was better than Infinity War. <sighs> mm, Black Panther, well, you know, Infinity War, it wasn't really meant to be, like, it's plot heavy, but we don't really see much character development because, obviously, there's so much backstory. 18 movies, you get to see all these characters build up. So Black Panther was cool in the sense that you get a little bit more in-depth with people, their motivations, their personalities, um, their interactions with each other. In Infinity War, it's non-stop action, and people are just put in there who already have huge stories behind them, and they just talk real quick and boom, do shit. So they're different kind of movies in a way. Um, Black Panther's more like a drama with action. And Infinity War is just non-stop. The camera never fucking has a dull moment in Infinity War. It's always boom, boom, boom. And I think that's beautiful all in itself, considering the movie's three hours. You know, movies are usually like an hour and a half because people get bored in the middle. I sat through Infinity War completely awake, alert, and intrigued, engaged. Nigga, I was immersed in that movie. I never once was like, ah, this is dragging out. It's getting dull. No. By the time we got to the end and you realize, yo, Been two and a half hours he's still winning uh what's going on <laughs> that shit fucked me up man it fucked me up real bad but it was good it was really really good infinity war left me with a thought what the fuck is happening the part of infinity that that's the part that honestly shocked me when i looked at my clock and i saw it was two hours and 30 minutes and Thanos was on a roll. It was like, bro, how is this movie going to end? They got to kill him real quick, I guess. And then when Thor hit the nigga with the axe, it was like, yes, that's how Thanos is beaten. And then just, oh, no. Uh, I know I already revealed a couple spoilers. I shouldn't be talking any further, man. I'm, I'm fucking myself up. My bad, guys. I, I can't help it. It's like thinking about the emotions I was feeling, bro. Fuck my life. My bad, dudes. My bad. My fucking bad, dudes. All right. Thanos threw a moon, bro. He said Thanos was like, nigga, what? Mm, Pull the fucking moon. He said, mm, like, yo, that was amazing. That was absolutely amazing. All right. No more spoilers. I'm sorry, guys. My bad. I'm sorry. I apologize. Please go see the movie. It's amazing. Don't, don't, don't hurt yourself. You're only slapping yourself in the face at this point if you haven't seen it by now. All right, guys, I'm going to be out of here. Thank you for coming through to the stream. It was really cool. Um, big thank yous to the donators who came through as well. Inks, man, thank you so much. I don't know if I... Did I see your donation earlier when you posted it, bro? My bad if I didn't. I was just caught up, man. Guys, have a good one, man. This weekend, it's going to be cool, bro. I didn't realize there were spoilers. I didn't know what the fuck you said. Well, Coke dealer, that's good. Go see the movie this weekend. Stop fucking around, all right, man? No bitch niggas. I'll see you guys later. Take care of yourselves. And then, of course, as usual, please have yourself a damn good one. Peace. I'm out, niggas. I'm fucking out.